Okay. Are we on? Is it working? Are we okay? <laughs> Hi! <laughs> Lolly ho! Lolly ho! If you can hear me! Hey oh Yeah! There you go! Nice! Yeah! We're on! We're in action, y'all! All right, let me just like notify everyone that we're on. Got a chance to stream a little bit earlier. Okay, we are live now. Thank you all for checking in on me and wanting to see if my voice is okay. My voice is okay. So thank you so much everyone for your, for your concern and consideration. I love it. It's such a sweet community that we have here. Uh, we may have some more uh, awesome community members joining us with the new uh, 30k growth. Hey! <laughs> if you weren't here last night for my stream, uh, kind of like news update and what's happening, I have a DM, I have a, uh, I have a dungeon master ready to go. I have a player ready to go. I'm waiting on two other players to see if they're gonna be okay, and it may take a few weeks. It may take a few weeks, but it's going to be worth a wait, I promise you, um, if they uh, are, um, are still interested in, in joining in. It's going to be an exciting time. I'm excited for Dungeons & Dragons. I, it's been over a year, maybe two, since I played Dungeons & Dragons. Um, and it's going to be chaotic. <laughs> I can promise you that. I can promise you that. I was making sure that I got the player balance for chaos and normalcy. <laughs> And I found my chaotic partner in crime, so I'm excited. I feel sorry for the other two people that will be joining in later. <laughs> um, but yeah, sorry if I'm looking like if I'm if I'm like not looking at the moment. I'm like texting while I'm doing this just to just to like do the announcement. Um, that persona is now live. Okay, uh, and then also put that in the Discord too, just in case. Um, YouTube, boop. Live now. Um, yeah, yes, uh, last yesterday, last week was a was a bit cookie. Um, you guys saw a little cringy side of me. I'm sorry. <laughs> I get a little, I get a little more unhinged when I'm around uh, people. <laughs> um, so apologize if that was like a bit much. Um, but now it's just me tonight. Uh, <laughs> you you've seen a little bit of my unhinged power. I'm embarrassed that you guys saw that. Hmm. <laughs> Let's see over here. All right, I got my, um, I went back and got seconds for fried rice. I'm so happy. And there's no cheese on it this time. <laughs> the no spoiler booba? Oh, of course, the no spoiler booba. In case people don't read the pin message, you are correct, sir. I'm still thinking back what happened last week. Oh my god. I feel like my my maturity like dropped 50%. <laughs> now where are those stickers? I know I have them around here somewhere. Where's my post-it note? Oh, there we go. All right, there you go. No spoiler booba. There you go. <laughs> you look at booba, you can't miss the spoiler. <laughs> okay. Um, let's see. Let's see. I did the dungeon announcement. Uh 
Final Fantasy Rebirth. I'm finally going to have a chance to play it uh, starting Monday, maybe. I don't know. April Fool's. <laughs> Who knows what's going to happen on that particular day? Especially when there's, th there's some kind of thunderstorm coming my way. So I swear to God, if somehow my internet just cancels on me on, on, on April Fool's Day, I definitely was the butt of the joke <laughs> for that I'm gonna be so mad. I'm gonna be so mad. <laughs> so I am hoping, I am hoping I don't get April Fools done by the weather. <clears throat> Yo, Kindred, thank you so much for the gifted. Um, D and D, I be down. Awesome. I'm glad you guys are excited for D and D. You guys are a bunch of nerds, and I love it. Nerds, gather here. This is the nerd community. <laughs> <laughs> Except we're like the really cool crowd. <laughs> I don't even know what that means. What does being cool even mean? I don't know. But anyways. I like to consider that you're um feeling secure enough to be yourself. That's cool. <laughs> Gifties already, hell yeah! Gifties already, let's go. All right, uh, nerdy night, yeah, hell yeah. So okay, so Monday, um, yeah, it's gonna be the the start of Final Fantasy VII unless the weather screws me over. <laughs> um, that's gonna be Gremlin Dipper time. So if you want to see me being completely chaotic as hell, and that will probably be my most. FF7 is going to bring that out of me. It's it's going to let out a lot of emotions out of me. So if that is too much, uh, then yeah, steer clear and just join in for Persona Nights. <laughs> oh my god. I'll be like Dipper 100% Max Gremlin. <laughs> uh, let's see. Any other updates I need to share with you guys? Um, I don't think so i guess there'll be new updates for the uh dipper merch store um i'm gonna just kind of i'm thinking of just like cleaning it all out and starting again from scratch maybe but i am getting rid of the new year's and the christmas dipper so if any of you guys want to you know grab that before it goes off the shelf um go for it um uh it's gonna stay up until uh until monday um there's also the uh, body pillow. I didn't realize I never put a store link in my store tab. <laughs> I've always had a body pillow, but I completely forgot to give you guys the access to it. <laughs> oh, so yeah, if if you've been one of the people who've been requesting for it, it it it's been there. I just failed to give you the key. <laughs> To enter. I don't go. <laughs> I don't go. But yeah, for those of you who participated in the Dipper, um, I guess, questionnaire that was happening in the community post, uh, I appreciate it. Thank you. I want to spend my time decatering to the things that you like. Um, uh, most of the stuff I put up in the in the merch store was just kind of random and what I thought was uh was something I like and that you may like, but I need to rethink my my perspective on on the business matter of things and you guys went for um black and white with maybe like a splash of color maybe here and there which i am all for so i'm excited merch art stuff will probably be out there faster and um you know just for fun uh for those of you who know uh yeah i'm still gonna throw up the the no cheese on fried rice uh art <laughs> just for fun Give y'all nightmares of that incident when I was cooking. But tonight I made fried rice! Tonight I made fried rice! Legit fried rice! I'm so excited! I'm so excited! Oh my god. Except, uh, I kinda, like, was just like, I, uh, why are you throwing edamame in there? I didn't have green peas. <laughs> so I just threw the edamame just to splash the color in. There's no cheese this time. Um, I did put a uh, uh, shrimp in it, but I should have cooked it in the fried rice. I actually ended up steaming it on the side. <laughs> so I'm a hot mess, but it's okay. fine. It functions. It's in my stomach. I don't think I'll be sick. 
It was hard to tell if the um, bottles were expired or not because there was no expiration date on it. Should be fine. It should be fine. Totally. Totally fine. I'm, I swear it's going to be fine. I want it to be fine. I hope it's fine. Anyways. I think I rambled enough. Who's ready for some persona? <laughs> oh, yeah. No, no, no. The one where I'm wearing black leather. That's going to stay. I worked my, I worked way too hard. I worked too, way too hard on that. But if it has like the 2024 glasses on it, that's going to be taken off. But dipper and leather? No, that's going to stay up there. <laughs> I've also been debating back and forth if I should just go ahead and make it a digital file for you to have access to. And then you can like print it on whatever you want. Mugs or or pillows or whatever. I'm still debating on it. Mouse pads if needed. It will be more on the pricier end though, because you will be getting the uh, the file, the uh, the art file. So then you can like go to Amazon and whatever with it. Okay, all right, let's do some persona. Yay! I think I just got fried. I think I have rice in my wrong in the wrong throat. Hold on, I need to cough it out. What one second? Oh no, no, it's in my throat. Come on, go down. <laughs> scuff, absolute scuff. <laughs> okay, I think I got it. Ah, all right. Now let's go ahead and start Persona. Woo, woo! Where, uh, tap, 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 tap. Persona time. All right, do I have everything good? Yes. Okay, yeah. Quick, please, start. Let's go. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> I think I got it out. Kawa Mama Night. Oh my god, I hope I get a chance to meet her. I didn't get to meet her the other time. Yo, Kappa, thank you so much for the gifted membership. You are my thieves guild. I'm fine. More pressure on you. <laughs> thank you so much, Kappa. Thank you, thank you. Oh, yeah, that rice is gonna stick. No! Hell yeah. I definitely want to make a Persona style. <clears throat> uh, fan art, though. Uh, or merch art. Definitely want that. Oh, maybe I'll do that for the Queen of Hearts. I have to have that smile. That smirky, cocky grin. I freaking love it. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for catching the stream. Get in, get in, get in while it's hot. Ekachi. Always, always getting in my way on Saturday nights. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
So who? Hey, we're gonna meet a nerd. We're gonna meet a nerd. I can't wait to meet this nerd. <clears throat> Hell yeah, let's go. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. The way things are progressing this year, I'm, I'm ecstatic. <laughs> For those of you who are joining in from the uh, latest content uh, uploads, thank you for joining in on Persona Night. I am so excited to have you here. Um, I am lagging. Oh no, give me a second. <laughs> I need to exit and enter again, I think. <laughs> Alright, there we go. And back in. <laughs> there we go. Smooth, smooth, smooth. Um, <laughs> so yeah, welcome to uh, another Persona Night, Friday and Saturday! Hello! Let's go gamers! <clears throat> also, um, I just realized that you all are having Easter this Sunday. I didn't realize. I was gonna get started and work on my Easter art next week until someone pointed that out in my Discord. And because my Easter is actually in May, <laughs> my Easter's on a different on a different day entirely, different month. <clears throat> uh, so I haven't thought of or prepared anything for Sunday. Uh, <laughs> maybe there'll be a random stream on Sunday. We'll see. Maybe we'll 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 fight for democracy. <laughs> I'm still terrible at that game, but I'm starting to have like a, a crazy uh, fun time in it. Glad you're feeling a lot better, Dever. Yeah, no, Clara, thank you so much. Cl Clara and Aya, thank you so much for dealing with my shenanigan and immaturity last week. And thank you so much for uh, helping out with the voiceover so that way I can quickly recover for this weekend. I, I really appreciate it. <clears throat> But yeah, different Easter. Yeah, Greek Orthodox. East. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, Greek Orthodox. You got it. You got it. October. You got it. That's what it is. Opa. But do not test my knowledge about anything Greek. I am basically one of the Greek failures out there. <laughs> my ancestors. My ancestors would weep. <laughs> Teaching democracy and philosophy and Socrates and. Aristoteles. <laughs> All the greats. And what is this Greek woman doing? I'm playing Persona. <laughs> I play per <laughs> I'm playing games and being a VTuber. This is where philosophy has gotten me. <laughs> Enjoy life because it's freaking short. Ah. Uh... All right, anyways. <laughs> <clears throat> Reminder, Kratos is also Greek. Oh, yeah. I actually haven't played that game, God of War. But I know it was really popular, or is. I don't know, is it still popular? I wonder if you guys would have any interest if I actually do get, uh, if I do play God of War. God, nothing but series here on this channel. Series, let's go. <laughs> Oh! Oh, you know I'm a f <laughs> You're not alone. I also know little to nothing about Greek. It's okay. It's okay. There are times we're in the ancient times. <laughs> we just sit back, relax, and enjoy our baklava. <laughs> and if you guys have never had baklava, can I suggest trying it if you somehow end up going to some Greek church event for fun i think it's on may 5th so yeah if you miss easter you're really like dang i miss my own easter go find a greek church and just completely crush their easter sunday it's on may 5th i don't even know if that's on a sunday <clears throat> but you have to try some baklava you're missing out if you haven't it's but unless you're allergic to nuts then don't have it but basically it's like a very thin crispy pastry with some nuts and honey in between. It's so good. Mmm. Ah, 
Now I gotta go visit my aunt. <laughs> she makes good, good pastries. Ooh, and the cookies too. Cookies with the coffee? Mmm. A delight. I'm making y'all hungry, I bet. Claire, you've tried baklava? Hell yeah! <laughs> Oh my god, Dipper's the only Greek failure that can challenge Jason. Who's Jason? Wait, what? <laughs> I only have it during Christmas. Oh, nice, nice. <gasps> I totally forgot. Oh my god. Oh, here's a fun little thing you guys can do. And I'll do like a fun little, I guess, like chat versus Dipper Greek Easter fun. I just need to find a camera to see if I can do a hand cam. But did you know on Greek Easter, you have, I don't know if any of you guys watched My Big Fat Greek Wedding, but there was like a small snippet where the two men cracked each other's like eggs um, and by smacking it. So like if one cracks and the other one's fine, that means you, the person who has the uncracked egg, is gonna have good luck for the year. Last year was mine. Last year was mine. I did it with my family and I had the good egg. My egg did not crack. <clears throat> And I was like, oh, it's gonna be a, this is gonna be a good year. I can feel it. And it was. A lot of good things happened. A lot of good things happened. So, um, I'm very, very grateful to that, to that egg. <laughs> All right. Anyways, let's go ahead and start Persona. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I normally prattle. I normally prattle so that way people will get notification from YouTube that uh, my stream is live. Sometimes there's some delay to that notification. Uh, if anyone ever gets irritated to like, oh man, YouTube failed to notify me or, or I missed out on Dipper stream, there, sh there should be a set reminder button um, when you click on, um, on a scheduled stream date. There should be one, but precaution, just taking precaution. All right, oh, jazz. I love it, and I'm having coffee too. I hope I don't get indigestion, fried rice and coffee. Mmm, what a mix. I'm on a Sunday. Sunday, smoothie! Let's go! All right, what's up, Dad? Hold on. Hey! I want to think. I'm already ran out of water? Plenty of you guys don't have to go potty anytime soon. I just like poured that water right next to the mic. Uh, speaking of, I forgot my 1000 member celebration. I'm supposed to do a, um, a karaoke and ASMR. Um, let me put that, pull that off a little bit longer. Because I don't want to just wreck my voice again anytime soon. <laughs> Unless we do just ASMR, I can I can easily do that. I'll be doing weird things like this, like wrapping my mic with plastic wrap and putting cream on it and just go just swirling around like I don't know. <laughs> <clears throat> Getting approved somewhat, somewhat. Right, we just had guts. Kindness. Okay. I wonder if there's like any Persona concerts. <laughs> a dipper is a gabber. Jibber jabber. <laughs> How many of you guys are excited for spring anime? We are drawing uh, near the end of the winter anime season. I'm curious what you all are excited to watch for spring. <clears throat> No, no, the Dragon Ball stream, I will, I, okay, I forgot it, I didn't, I did wait, I don't, wait, can I, like, schedule things on Twitch now? I think I can. There will be a Dragon Ball stream, it's not gonna be this weekend, it's gonna be next weekend. I, I am officially declaring it out loud. <laughs> there will be a Dragon Ball, a Dragon Ball event, we're gonna watch our favorite moments of Dragon Ball, um, to show our love and, uh, to the, to the memory, to the man that created Dragon Ball, Dragon Quest. Uh, Dr. Slump, um, and a whole other, um, and a whole, a whole lot of great things. Bless that, bless that man's heart. 
Okay, let's see. Uh, oh, it's the evening. What did I do today? I can't even remember what I did. Can I leave? Did I get my smoothie? Good night. Okay, no, I don't remember what happened. I'm, I'm gonna hope I got my smoothie. All right, well, I guess we're just gonna go ahead and do the next day. Hey. Uh, wait, can I watch something? Oh. Right, I rented a movie. Charming. Hell yeah. It's gonna be a freaking Casanova. How can you expect to write for a fashion magazine when you dress like a fashion victim? Because I really like words and pants. Okay. <laughs> it's a story about a woman struggling against adver adversity and prejudice. Nice. Looks, uh, looks, ugh, looks have nothing to do with what's inside. I can sympathize with, with her. Yeah, sorry, no voice acting. I can, I can just do the bare minimum of just reading, so. <laughs> I see. What's really important is not your appearance, but what's on the inside. Maybe you learn a thing or two about charm. Hmm. Nice. I should just go and eat burgers every night. It just does everything at once. Did it really throw out Crunchyroll ads as soon as I was talking about anime? That's so bizarre. I wonder if it's like a weird coincidence. Or is YouTube listening to me? Oh my god. Oh hey look, the red lipstick! Hmm. <laughs> Right. The tenth was the Sunday that he just confessed, wasn't it? It was a refreshing morning. How are you doing? That's what we accomplished last night. Uh, not last night, last week. Um The confession scene. Well, it wasn't really much of a scene, but I wonder what's gonna happen next. I didn't expect the Phantom Thieves would suppress a man that even the police had trouble with. The fact they have so much support online is worrisome. I'm in a bind since I previously denounced them. I mean, you have to admit, Akechi, they're kind of heroes. They took down a criminal. All the interviews these days ask me about that. Still, can we really say the Phantom Thieves are on the side of justice with just this example? We're good outlaws. We're the new Justice League. What do you mean? Let people talk. Mm, actually, I want to dig into your brain. I was originally investigating the mental shutdown incidents. People change suddenly and cause strange accidents or horrible crimes. Oh, he's having me confused with the other party members. The bad guys. The politics. Oh, evil government system. Don't you think it's similar to the change of heart that the Phantom Thieves are doing? Yeah, but we're the good guys. Hmm. Now that I think about it, their actions mirror the mental shutdown cases with the rate of victims. It's not related. I mean, it's related, but we're not part of it. It's impossible not to see a connection there. No! Ah, sorry. I don't want to make you late. I'll see you again. If only Akechi will become a phantom thief, this will be so much easier. Dang. Oh well. Shibuya crime ring reveals all. The leader's confession has led to the arrest of other key members. Sudden rampage, highway accidents. The driver's death has been confirmed, to taking the total count up to four. Hot spots of Tokyo. Come see the summer fireworks. I wonder if I can take Kawa on a date there. 
I see. But how can I take a date? How can I take a teacher out on a date? I'm underage. Game, why you do this to me? This is mean. We're getting more and more famous. Jeez. Okay, let's get started. Good guys is a very subjective term. We basically dealt with a guy that was going to rob a student. We did good. <laughs> Husband. I know some of you rely on all-nighters, but I can't recommend it. That really messes up your information retention. Where were you when I was in high school? All I did was stay up and pull all-nighters to sit for tests. <clears throat> oh, speaking of, do you guys know the difference between short-term and long-term memory? What an odd question this is happening after I was playing a... Um, a... Uh, God, what was it called? It was some AI-ish dating game app I was doing for one of my videos and I just I couldn't think of anything unique so I ended up calling the uh the uh, the character Joker and the Joker was playing <laughs> would you rather uh have no short-term memory or no long-term memory actually I'm curious what you guys will say I'm gonna do that to you hold on hold on start a poll would you rather Hey, welcome to my stream. We had to have fun here. Have no short-term memory. Have no long-term memory. Boom, start the poll. Have fun. <laughs> Won't be long before I start asking you, like, weird ass questions like, would you rather have Cheeto fingers or hot pepper fingers? <laughs> the simple answer is that short term memory is more temporary, contextually, but long term memory sticks with you. In short term memory, you're working with a hard limit. You retain only six, maybe seven pieces of information but your brain's capacity for long-term memory is huge. It might even be infinite, according to some theories. How about you? Uh-oh. What do you think about all this? Short-term memories only stick with you for seconds at a time. That said, how long do you think you can retain long-term memories? Um... If it's traumatic enough, forever. Uh... Memories that last a long time. Memories of your whole life that just last a long time. I don't know, I guess. The answer is B? It's B. It's gotta be B, I can't. <laughs> <clears throat> That's my answer. What do you guys think? <laughs> Wow, no short-term memory. I love how you guys are getting into this. I love it. All right. Always see. <laughs> sloth, sloth. <laughs> the question is how long? Maybe we mentioned something about the amount of memories you could store, right? Really? Doesn't it vary between person to person? There isn't just like a limit to how much memories you can retain for life, right? So it's gotta be C, I'm hoping. Oh, hell yeah. Our golden answer. Yeah, in case any of you guys have missed out or haven't seen it, I have added the the answer is always C um, on a mug, but I can put that on a shirt, I guess, next. 
but right now there's a there's a there's a the answer is always C persona mug <laughs> at the merch store. If you have theoretically infinite space for them, then theoretically you'd be able to retain them. Uh for ever. The answer is always C. The answer is always C. It has to be. I can't be wrong. I'm not gonna even gonna check. C. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah, okay, cool. This is it. That's right. Hell yeah. C always wins. Except for that first question. <laughs> Kappa! Thank you so much for the membership. Thank you. Enjoy your emotes and access to my um, not so safe cooking stream. <laughs> Among other uh, games I have hidden. <laughs> scuff stuff basically stuff uh, um, encoded into your long-term memory never really goes away short-term memories become long-term memories through reiteration it'd be great if you could encode all the test answers to long-term memory huh oh well can't always get what you want sorry this is me like trying to relax my voice <laughs> A big brain. <laughs> I I was going through clips from last weekend and um, it hurt. It hurt rewatching that one moment where the uh, the questionnaire of like, what is the the what is the shape or whatever the question was between A through through E or something like that. <laughs> I was in pain rewatching that moment. I'm just like, I don't know if I want to clip this or not. This is, this is really dumb. <laughs> oh my god. Nice going. I honestly get shocked sometimes when I go back and try to find clips where I think it's gonna be funny, but then when I rewatch it, I'm just like, oh god. <laughs> This is bad. <laughs> <laughs> but at least you've got summer break once the exams are over. So do your best to study, okay? The triangle. Don't you mean the square? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, memories never really go away. That means I'll remember my past eventually, right? I remember going to a... Um, a sur uh, oh god, what was it called? I can't remember what it's called. Um, a senior home. And there was this um, lady who was next to my grandma who happened to have... Um, uh, who happened to have suffered a memory loss. Um, so... She basically like grew up in um, I think it was in Greece For like five years and then moved and came to the US and then has spoke English ever since and even Relatives have said that she doesn't remember how to speak Greek uh, but until she got into the senior home and um, and, and the memories did like their thing when you're old uh, she didn't know how to speak English and instead spoke fluent Greek, the language she hasn't spoken for decades. So the brain is fascinating. Alzheimer's? Possibly. It may have been that. You're kind of suffering memory loss right now. <laughs> Every day I suffer a memory loss. There's nothing new. Hence me live streaming so I can remember what the heck I've been doing. <laughs> 718 Marine Day. Finals end on the 16th, so that should be good, right? What are you talking about? The fireworks festival. You're really quick to look up that stuff, huh? Uh, impressive, Ryuji. I'll be nice. I'm feeling good today. It's easy to work when you when you got a gold mine, yeah? True. Hey, we're in the middle of class. Talk about those things later. Yeah, yeah. 
Hey, are you listening? Uh, when do I ever? <laughs> I feel a murderous intent. Go for it. Go for it. Try to throw something at me. See what happens. Oh shit! Why did I dodge? <laughs> I got so cocky! <laughs> what the hell? What happened to what happened to my skills? Oh Piccolo will be mad! Why didn't you dodge? <laughs> oh my god! I can't believe that happened! <laughs> I know, I know, I need to work on my proficiency. I didn't realize. I thought I was good. We're gonna. <laughs> I thought I was good. Wow, way to, like... <laughs> what? That teacher just took my ego down a notch and made me more humble and be like, Oh shit, I shouldn't have time. I shouldn't have been talking smack. <laughs> that teacher's been practicing uh, his, his throwing hey. technique um, <laughs> after school. He leveled up. <laughs> he leveled up without me knowing. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna get myself together again. Ah, oh, okay. Heading home? It's rare running into you at this hour. That reminds me. Oh, that reminds me. Do you remember the counseling um, Dr. Maruki's offering? It seems to be growing quite popular. I saw someone heading to the nurse's office just as I was leaving the school. I'm still thinking back on it. <laughs> what are you gonna do, throw chalk at me? <laughs> Good God. Uh, <coughs> Did you just say he's been well worth the, his time here? But I have a feeling there's more to his popularity than just talent. His looks, his personality. Uh, what's not to like about this guy? <sighs> Maybe I should find out for myself at some point. Yeah, go, 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 go. It's gonna be a good time. Huh. What about studying? <laughs> she has such a cute laugh. Naturally, that'll still happen when I get home. It's part of my daily routine. Excuse me. I appreciate your concern, but how about yourself? Depending on the exam scores, there may not be a fireworks festival for anyone to attend. Were you aware? Ooh. <laughs> I'm joking. But, but make sure you study well, alright? <laughs> alright then. Don't forget about the new free snacks. Yeah, that too. That's a perk. I need to buy some more test prep booklets on my way home. See you later. You don't want me escorting you or anything? Alright. Oh, Kasumi! What a pleasant surprise. Are you headed home too? I was about to. What's up? Same here. I don't have club practice today. <gasps> Let's go practice! That reminds me. There's something I wanted to report to you. Would now be a good time? Yeah! I'm free. Thank you. Why don't we find a seat somewhere? Okay. Huh? No! Dude, get away! You're gonna ruin my Riz! You've already ruined it for me with Kala! Don't do this again! <laughs> and you are... Ah, Jesus. It's been quite a while, Akechi-san. You guys know each other? I kind of forgot. Have you guys bumped into each other earlier? Or I can't remember. And the same for you, Yoshizawa-san, right? You know each other? Oh, okay, there we go. My father works at a TV station. 
Hmm. Have you ever seen Good Morning Japan? My father's the director. Ooh, how many of you guys go watch Good Mythical Morning? I don't see it religiously, but <clears throat> I can never forget about it. I've been brought onto the show as a guest a number of times now. That's how I ended up becoming acquainted with Yoshizawa-san. I didn't know you knew her as well. Uh, she and I made a deal. She's my friend. He helped me out of a jam before, and now he's been offering me guidance. Helped you out of a jam, huh? I... So, what were you two up to? We're about to talk. This is an A B conversation, so see yourself out, please. Oh, right. I was just about to share some exciting news <clears throat> with me. Just me. It's nothing to keep secret, so I may as well spill it now. Well, this just made this less eventful. Thanks. <laughs> about that summer competition I mentioned to you before. I was chosen to be our club representative. Uh, congrats. <laughs> I love this game. This only feels like the beginning to me, though. Isn't your club's team considered to be quite prestigious? Dipper is, super, is possessive? Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> and you're their representative. I must say, that's extremely impressive. Mm. Thank you. I'll do my best to make everyone proud. I'll be cheering you on as well. Ah, I have an idea. Since all three of us are here, why don't we go somewhere as a group? <laughs> Dipper's just making her, marking her territory. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Nothing unnatural about what I'm doing. How I'm behaving. <clears throat> we can call it our little celebration for Yoshizawa-san's success. That would be wonderful. Does that work for you, senpai? <sighs> Doesn't look like I have a choice. Sure. Sounds great. That settles it. Would you mind if I chose the place? There's a wonderful little cafe I know about. Of course. Lead the way. Yoshizawa-san? You drink hot beverages even in the summer? to prevent my body from getting too cold since the meat's coming up rather soon <clears throat> I see you make sure you're covering all your bases your drink's just as hot good point <laughs> well some people say coffee can cool you off even when hot so I try to avoid that too I had this image that you enjoy sweet things Akechi-san is that untrue? We're at a crepe place, so it's gotta be true. I swear I saw you eating fried sweet bread on TV just the other day. Mmm, bread. It's all part of a marketing strategy. That sort of stunt is an easy crowd pleaser. You seem to have your own bases covered as well. I feel lied to. <laughs> Presenting oneself in a favorable light is nothing surprising. More surprising is just how innocent you seem to be. Wait, what? Hold on. Innocent? I'm a ferocious beast. Rawr. I've been wondering, how do you two know each other? This guy just followed me and wouldn't leave me alone. His social studies class visited the set of a TV show I appeared on. Was it my good looks that attracted you? What was it? What was it, Akechi? <clears throat> That's right. Second year's got to go to a TV station. He and I exchanged our opinions during the shoot, and his way of thinking intrigued me. Scary. <laughs> Most people be scared away, I think. I can definitely see that. Senpai's take on things often helps me as well. That reminds me, Yoshizawa-san. You had mentioned that he's been providing you with some guidance. I love that this is mostly voiced. Uh, Lucky. <laughs> yes, like you just said, 
His way of thinking is intriguing. I figured I could benefit from his input. In that case, let's play a little game. Oh god. Please tell me we're not going to be playing any kind of game that's related to the that Saw movie. <laughs> Would you mind if I posed the same question to you that I first asked him? No. Wait, what? No. Go right ahead. I forgot the question. What was it? So, my question was, uh-huh. What do you think of the Phantom Thieves Yoshizawa-san? Oh, that question. I have good faith in her. She's going to say we're good people. The Phantom Thieves? You mean in the case that they do in fact exist, yes? I admit that the assistance of others in need is a truly great act. Hell yeah. But I simply can't agree with their methods. What? I see. Care to explain why? I suspect the Phantom Thieves' existence isn't going to be beneficial to society in the long run. I mean, we're making a difference to some people at least, who is basically not going to have some mental breakdown later down the road, so, you know, one's better than none. How so? Well, for example, when someone's faced with a problem to overcome, I believe they need to do it themselves. Getting help from others is totally fine, but in the end, it takes a person's initiative to truly create lasting change. Wow. If society relied upon a safety net like the Phantom Thieves, I worry that people would stop making a conscious effort. Uh, what, hold on, that's the worst case scenario. The other scenario, you, Kasumi is that we could be inspiring people to make more of an effort. Granted, this depends on how severe the problem is, and it's inaccurate to apply generalizations to an entire population. Damn, this girl got her bases covered. She's smart. But I believe a society where everyone simply leaves matters to the phantom thieves wouldn't last for very long. That's an impossible scenario. I there <laughs> Everyone does so many different things. Uh, no, no, no. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> I see. So, in the sense of a person's growth, their actions actually hinder it. Hold, hey, hey, Akachi, Akachi, you're only nitpicking at the spots that you want. You're, you're just nitpicking at the spots that you, like, hold on. You are selecting. You are being selective. You're not no, no, bad Ekichi. Quite an interesting take on the matter. I just don't know what to think with this guy around me. Let me ask you then. What do you think of Yoshizawa-san's opinion? It's a unique stance. <laughs> I mean, she's not wrong and she's not entirely right. <clears throat> oh shit, that was hot. Ooh. <laughs> hmm. What was the closest thing I said? Wait, what was hold on. She's not wrong. It's a unique stance. That was helpful. I think I did say that she's not wrong at some point. Like, okay, true, but I did that. I did that. I did the whole it's true, but. Uh, I think unique stance. I think unique stance. Yeah, yeah. Let's do unique stance. <laughs> Quite. I'd say it's equally as unique as your own opinions. Okay, cool. Wait, could you actually be a fan of the Phantom Thieves, Senpai? <laughs> a fan? <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes. I didn't mean to start an argument. I just can't help myself sometimes. Wait, what argument? Let's change the subject to something a bit lighter. I didn't even have a chance to debate. Let me debate. I'm sorry. I should probably get going. What was it? Wait, no. If I'm away from home too late, my parents will begin to worry. Do you need me to walk you? Right. Then let's call it a day. 
Good luck on your competition. I'll be rooting for you. You got this. Yes, thank you. Well then, see you later. She's very, very well behaved. I feel like I can't really goof around around her. <clears throat> ah, you're back. If that makes any sense. I see you had your friends over for a study session, huh? Uh, how'd you know? Nothing gets by me. I own the place, remember? I can tell what goes on here just by looking at the tables. Oh. Huh. That accident this morning was awful. Did they go out of control again? Like that one time? That's what I hear. The driver was acting funny or something. Vice president in our company might have been caught up in it. I'm sure it's chaos in this office. Let's go. When are these weird accidents going to end? I don't feel safe getting into my car anymore. Oh. Uh... Oh boy. There's, there's a lot of girls. I'm already bummed about the test coming up. I'm in trouble for anything that's not English. I haven't been studying at all. Oh, maybe we can make some progress if we keep an eye on each other. You wanna study together? Like, right now? Uh, but Shogi Girl. I like her weird aggressiveness when she plays Shogi. <laughs> what? Ah, Kappa! Yo, thank you so much! <clears throat> thank you so much for the gift of 10 memberships! Yo! Rock on! Let's go! More members! Chaos crew growing! To get better at Shogi, you must practice every day. If you're interested in a lesson, please come to the church. Oh boy. Okay, hold on. Let me just check on my plant first. Nice. Looks healthy for now. All right. Um, let's go with the um overly aggressive shogi player. As uh, better strats mean better battle system. Let's go. Excellent. I'll be waiting. Sorry, on. But you offered studying. I don't want to do that. Well, who are you? Why are you here? Get out of my face. Oh? If Fumi's talking to someone, she seems kind of troubled. I feel like my bond with Fumi will grow stronger soon. What are you going to do? Wait, 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 Check bond with Fumi. Hold on. Uh, I need Arcana. It's the star. I don't think I have that with me. Hold on. But I, um, hold on. Wait a minute. Uh. Hey. I, I am, I am, I am, I am. I just need to check something. I don't think I have it. I have nothing for her, for, for her. Oh. 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 <laughs> You got a star persona with you? I do not. Hold on. I need to. Okay. Kanda station and church. Uh, blah, 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 blah. No, my money. Whatever. I have plenty of money. Uh, Shibuya? Do they really not have a thing here? They're not here? Hmm. Dang, yeah, no, they're not there. Okay, uh. Velvet room. <clears throat> Unfortunate. Hey, inmate! Time to experiment. The fortune you persona? With me? Didn't I already do that? With the fortune teller? Uh, the inmate needs our guidance. You wish to perform fusion. I, I wish to make some kind of star. Let us begin the search. I don't 
I don't have it. I can't... I can't make one. Finished for now. You'd like to read the compendium? Uh... You want to register it? Wait, hold on. These are the paths you have walked. Wait, which one I'm looking for again? Star or Kana? <clears throat> I'm checking. That's unfortunate. Hey, good old Matador, my main ingredient. Ooh, I do have one. Is this what you want? Yeah. You always draw this persona then. Yeah. This persona. My money. It's fine. Are you finished? Yep. What? It is time, inmate. All right, we're good, Chief. Uh My money. Oh. Hmm. Word of advice? Hold on. Learn my lesson to chew my food and not talk at the same time. <sighs> Word of advice, if you're going to do the fortune arcana, commit. It is worth it by the end. Commit? Uh, okay, yeah, I can do the, the fortune per, uh, thingy tomorrow. Thank you for shaking my hand. I'm never gonna wash it. Gross. Huh? Um, please wash it. I can't believe that you're really here in a church. I read on the internet that you pray to God for victory. Is that true? No. Can I take a selfie with you and post it online? Sorry, I've been turning down all such requests. By the way, is it true that you're trying to become a professional shogi player? Oh my god, the persistent male fan. Yeah, she she wants her space, dude. You're not reading the room. Well, nothing's been... I'll be cheering for you to qualify. You'd be the first woman to surpass the third Dan League. I really believe in you. Thank you very much. Good evening. Oh, well, you know, it's fine. He's... He was just showing his, um... His support, so. Oh, that's hot. <clears throat> Men like that approach me all the time. At first I thought they were, you were one of them. I really must apologize for being rude to you. Um. It bothers me when people make such a big fuss over me. Considering that the priest is do doing me a great favor by letting me play here. You see, he's my shogi friend, and he's a, he's very kind. He once told me that he wanted to become a professional player, and he doesn't laugh at my embarrassing habit when we play shogi. Oh. Oh, so that's why you're here in a church. I thought it was odd. So, I did the photo shoot. I'm embarrassed just thinking about it. Did you see it? It was called the venue of Shogi. Ah, uh, no, I didn't check the papers or anything. I'm sorry. Was I supposed to see it? I've been a very, very busy man. <laughs> ah, that was good. No I'm kidding. <laughs> Low hanging fruit joke. <clears throat> Just getting more tea. Did you see it? I did not see it. I'm sorry. Described you perfectly. No, I didn't. That's quite the headline. 
I have a feeling this is going to be a point system, though. Uh, I don't know what she likes. Does she not want me to see it? Or is she hinting that she wants me to see it? Is the answer C? I hope the answer is C. <laughs> Very busy raising you and the others. No time to read. <laughs> Perfect description. Yes. It certainly is. Was she blushing? But no notes. So that was not the right answer. Shoot. The answer wasn't C. The answer was A. No! <laughs> A mistake was made. Oops. Um, it's not really an excuse, but the editorial staff came up with that title on their own. Ever since I won the female shogi league, I've been getting a lot of attention. I just figured it would, it could, it could. Blah. I just figured I could contribute to the shogi world. Besides, my mother seems to be very happy. Whenever I win, she rejoices as if it were her own victory. So I want to live up to the expectations she has for me. However, she's been a bit overzealous lately. She set up the interview and photo shoot. It's as if she wants to be the manager of a celebrity. You don't enjoy it? Having a difficult time? You should just decline. Uh, she doesn't seem to enjoy it. She seems to be having a difficult time. Uh, you should just decline it. Does it? It sounds like you don't want to do it. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna wait for you guys first. The answer is B. Okay. <laughs> you all are smart. You got some riz on you. Nice job. A bit, but it's fine because it's for my mother. Sorry. I should be teaching you how to play instead of talking about my mother. Today I'll be showing you something very practical. How many people are there to Riz? Oh, there's a lot so far and we're not even halfway through the game. Are we halfway through the game? We're not even halfway through. It's a tactic for using the reverse pawns you've taken from your opponent in a more effective way. Nevertheless, I apologize. You're such a good listener. I feel at ease speaking with you. Actually, aside from the priest, you're actually the first person I've spoken to about my mother. Hmm. Chance for a follow up by a backup member if Joker downs an enemy. Hmm. All right. Now then, I will instruct you while we play. I look forward to it. Ready? Ready, steady, go! Do you guys know what I'm singing? Or humming? <laughs> <laughs> Until next time. Knowledge. <clears throat> I feel like I want to do like anime opening trivia with you all and see if you can answer it or not. How much of a nerd are you? Oh, someone's got it. Nice! Ah, <laughs> uh, this is Hifumi. I appreciate you spending time with me today. Um, I ended up feeling much better after sharing my concerns with you. But this hardly seems fair. How can I teach you properly when I'm this distressed? Bring it on, don't worry about it. This is part of our deal too. Was it? Was listening part of her deal? I can't remember. Is that a challenge? Do y'all want to have an anime night? Like, a quiz night? Ahem. 
<laughs> there is a something where, um, if you guys like throw your name somewhere in some Google form, I can basically like grab it's kind of it's got it's kind of like a like a um like a like a roulette and in, and if your name gets called i'll be i'll be challenging you how well do you know your anime <laughs> do you know the opening <laughs> all right answer's a okay sweet bring it on really it's a oh she likes that I can't- I don't know what this girl likes. Oh, are you sure? You really are a strange individual, but thank you for the encouragement. If that's the case, I can only hope to repay you through my lessons. Dude, I can't risk this girl. I- not on my own. <laughs> you make for a refreshing opponent. Somehow the more we exchange, the more I feel my world expanding. Teaching you is also a great learning experience for me, as it leads to a deeper understanding of myself. Well then, if you'll excuse me, I'll see you for our next match. It's a date? <laughs> Summer festival, huh? How can anyone eat so much fatty foods when it's so hot out? Because it tastes good! Man, you just don't get it. It's because it's hot out that we eat all that meat. Come on, let's go check it out. I'll treat you to a skewer. Hmm. Hmm. A summer festival, huh? You think they'll have any uh, A5 beef there? Ooh. Well, you should worry about finals first. Once those are over, it'll be summer vacation, so stay focused. Mmm. So close. My hope rests with the Phantom Thieves. What? I'm so glad the Phantom Thieves are all over the Neos. Energetic guy, nice. She's just built different. <laughs> yeah, I, I just saw it. I haven't had a chance to play Dragon Quest. Oops. It's on the list. It's on the list. But whether I play Dragon Quest or not is going to kind of rely on... Um, what you guys choose. Except Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, that's non-negotiable. I am streaming it. <laughs> that is, that is the one non-negotiable game. I'm streaming it whether you guys like it or not. <laughs> and be a complete menace. You can't stop me. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, they've really taken off since the whole Kamoshida thing. I'm so excited for Monday. I'm so excited for Monday. Oh my god, it's been like almost a month. <laughs> the Legend of the Phantom Thieves started at our school. We're practically one of them. Really? Who can't relate to what they're doing? Punishing corrupt adults up to no good. The police should take notes. That simple. <laughs> Quiet down. People sure are making a fuss, even if it's, even though it's right before exams. Behind Kaneshiro's arrest are the Phantom Thieves, the mysterious group that changes people's hearts. If I recall, there were similar rumors back during the business with Kamashita kun What a shitter! Sorry. <laughs> Help the weak and crush the strong. Truly a modern legend of the gentleman thief. In the long history of humans, the Gentleman Thief has been seen briefly during times of turmoil. Now then, please look at this picture. Another quiz? Oh no. Uh, it's a demon abducting a woman? This picture depicts the final moments of Ishikawa Gomen. Do you know the answer? Hmm. He did something during the Sengoku period that had him and his family boiled to death. Do you know what he did? No. What did he do? He 
You got in a fight? Missionary work? Fraud? Thievery? Fraud? It's one of these two. It's either fraud or thievery. What is it? Thief? He's a thief? Oh, phantom thief. Okay, got it. This is it. Correct. Nice one, guys. Ishikawa Goman is Japan's most famous thief. He's very popular, and some call him the gentleman thief. That's what Joker's based off of, I assume. <clears throat> kind of. He's Japan's version of Robin Hood. Sweet. By the way, the Goman bath comes from his name. Only stealing from the rich and powerful and sharing with the poor. Goman's exploits have been documented in many forums of media, like kabuki and novels. So is this based off a true story? Is this guy real? Nice going. Have you ever watched Lupin? I haven't watched it, but I've heard of it. Yeah, he was real? Nice. However, it's actually unclear whether or not Goman was indeed a gentleman thief. Rebellion against the Hideyoshi, whose campaign had failed, propaganda by the government is solely his name. The gentleman thief, Goman, may be no more than an illusion made by varying motivations. In actuality, most heroes and gentlemen thieves throughout history are something like that. Yep. <clears throat> Let's make sure people don't think we're just an illusion. But before that, you need to study for the exams that's our, that are starting tomorrow. Ew. <gasps> My man. It's open. Where are you? <laughs> I want to meet someone like you in real life. Welcome. Oh, you're the student council president, Nijima-san, correct? Excuse me. Sorry for coming by so suddenly. It was nothing. Oh no, everyone's permitted to stop by whenever they like. I know the phrase counseling session can make some people nervous, but don't be. Considering you're the student council president, I'd rather they didn't force you to come here at all, actually. No. Well, I was advised to come, but I still chose to do it on my own. Good. Okay, good. Glad to hear it. But please, there's no need to be concerned about my being here. Feel free to discuss anything with me. Uh, yes. Oh, right. Uh, so I shall. <laughs> You're sounding more like the counselor in here than I am. I see. Oh, that was cute. She fixed her hair. Ah, more coffee. Mmm, 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 mmm. Nothing like a good cup of joe at 9.30 p.m. <laughs> Joker's based upon Arsene Lupin by Maurice LeBanc. Oh yeah, I think you guys told me about this earlier. Whoops. Excellent grades, exemplary uh, conduct. Wow, you appear to be the ideal honor student. He's no. impressed. <laughs> oh, not at all, in fact. Quite the opposite. I'm actually a bit of a mess, and I always have to turn to others for help. Well, you sure had me fooled. Even still, getting help isn't a bad thing at all. In fact, it's wonderful that you have a support system. Indeed. Especially lately. I feel like I can't do anything right for myself nowadays. Hmm. Did something go wrong for you? Yes. Yes, but it's nothing major. Liar! Talk about your sister. I've come to understand all too well that it's a bad idea taking on more of a burden than one should. Oh, I feel that. I made the mistake to, like, continuously offer help without realizing I was burning myself out by doing that. Definitely be aware of your limits. And then I, I think I offered it too much that people got very comfortable asking me for things that I would do. And it just burnt me out. 
because it was just too much and I didn't know how to say no. But what a miracle world no is. Once you learn that word no, no, oh my god. It's a nice word. I like the word no. <laughs> <laughs> I've come to understand all too well that it's a bad idea. Uh, I've already did that. Hmm. You really do seem like someone with a mature sense of responsibility. However, that may be why people around you, especially the adults who should be protecting you, rely on you so much. <sighs> adults who should be protecting me. Had I been clever enough to understand that earlier, things may have gone a bit differently for me. You think so? <sighs> uh, you live alone with your older sister, I see. Parting my saying so, but it seems you've been through quite a lot. But... Honestly, it only felt like the norm to me. But our lack of adult guardians has to have been hard on my sister. Even now as well. And I'd be lying if I said it wasn't hard for me too. Do you still remember them? Your parents? Yes. Hey, so... Not as much about my mother, admittedly, but my father, without a doubt. In fact, now that I think about it, I may have what... I may well have grown to be a bit uptight because of that. See. Is that so? Wow, we're getting really in depth here with with Makoto. And are you doing okay now? Is your support system acquaint adequate? Blah, blah. Oh. He's a really good counselor. It's not as if I have a team of employees or anything, but I do have people that I'm able to rely on. Of course, I never think of them as replacements for my father or my sister. No one could replace either of them. What I've lost won't ever come back. I just need to keep my chin up. And push towards my future. Question. Has Makoto ever mentioned how her father died? Also, let me go ahead and get rid of that fool. I'm so sorry. I just realized that was there. I'll do it after this. Quite. Hmm, I like the way you put that. No one can ever be replaced. Yet we need to keep pushing towards our future. Should anything come up that you want help with, I'll be there to support. I'll be there to support you, though my skills are pretty limited. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate the kind words. Hey. Mm. There we go. And the poll. <laughs> Fascinating. 75% I have no short term memory. <laughs> but the power of no awaken your rebellious spirit. That's pretty much what's happening in this game, isn't it? It's it's learning the word no. <laughs> Oh my god, this game teaches you no, no, boundaries, no. <laughs> so what's Persona about? It teaches you how to say no. <laughs> and the consequences if you don't if you don't learn how to say no. <laughs> oh my god. That's it, you guys. I, f I found out Persona in, in less than 30 seconds. Describe Persona in one word. <laughs> no. <laughs> Anyways. Where's that 1%? Yeah, I know. Where's the 1%? The math don't math, right? 75% and 24%. We're missing a percentage. <laughs> it went to the void. <laughs> oh my goodness. I... <laughs> I'd be pretty sad if the leader of the Phantom Thieves got bad grades. Hey! Hmm? Shouldn't you tell the others about the target in Memontos? That's not an that second way. We need more we need more problems in, in Mementos before we make that jump. Ah, exams are close. Exams are coming up. Have you have your studies been going well? 
I can give you a general idea of what they were like when I was a second year. What do you think? Want to study together? That sounds like a hard yes. We're gonna learn so much. Yeah, we're gonna go. Way hold on, decide later. Uh I wonder, can I Can I check my teacher? Not my teacher, but um student council room. <laughs> Wait, no, 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 not the student council room. Where's my... Where, 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 A. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, is he here? Where is he? Hmm. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. 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 I cannot remember where 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 is Maruki Senpai. Hmm. Hmm. I forgot where Maruki is. No. Oh, whatever. Fine. Hey Makoto, let's go ahead and do stuff, I guess. Uh, let's go. Hubby's in the nurse office. I don't know where the nurse office is. I get lost. <laughs> the practice building? Oh, well, shoot. This goes like this. Next time. <laughs> now solve this problem using the Pomolia I just taught you. I hope An's not gonna get mad at me for ditching her and now I'm with Makoto. <laughs> this is kind of messed up. Do you understand? Mm, I think I can do it. It seems like you're studying a little more effective efficiently today thanks to Makoto's help. Oh, wow. Wait, what? Hot damn, Makoto, you making me real smart. Thank you. I agree. Impressive, Dipper. You're a quick learner. Wait, did I just miss on knowledge opportunity la the other night with An? This is actually pretty good review for me as well. Ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. Studying is real good, especially when the with the best girl. Right, yeah. Number one girl. <laughs> well then, let's move on to the next problem. I'll see you later. Well, I think this is a good place to stop for today. I'm getting knowledge. Without a doubt. Easy. Ah, you're back. Alright, it's pretty late. Yeah. I guess I should head home. I I guess. Uh a message. Oh no, you. I mean, cool, it's my boy. <laughs> Exams are coming up soon. You're not getting a jump on studying without me, right? Right? Oh my god. If you're gonna do it, you wanna do it together? I'm in serious trouble. So what's it gonna be? Do you wanna study with Ryuji? I don't want to. <laughs> Where's on? Ah, it's a Tuesday night. I could go out and eat a burger. Damn it! I feel like I need to help this boy though. Oh, let's go right away. That's a huge help. Yeah, I know you'll need it. I'll be waiting at the diner in Shibuya. Well, at least we're good to eat at the same time while studying. How am Mama's Friday and Saturday? <laughs> Don't worry, I have her. I have her memorized. Come on, you guys, get it memorized. <laughs> have it memorized. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Every time, every time, I can't stop thinking about that guy. <laughs> Studying with you really helps me focus, Dipper. 
Well, I'm having tons of trouble with these questions. How are things going for you? And better not find out I did all this. I'm studying with everyone else but her. Uh, better than usual. Seeing someone in danger of failing his exam is probably extra motivation for you, huh? Oh my god, more knowledge! I'm an encyclopedic! <laughs> yeah! Wow! All right. I'm super smart. I should be fine with my test tomorrow. <laughs> Brain blast. <laughs> Ugh, I gotta do this. How lame. How lame would it be if a Phantom Thief got held back a grade? Dude, I got six points for knowledge today. That's pretty awesome. I guess I'll try super hard because you're here, Dipper. Okay, let's do the rest. My god, I lost so much knowledge power. Oh no, now I feel bad for skipping on and on. Getting smart, <laughs> yeah. Yo, sup? I just heard this, but apparently we're having a summer festival soon. I heard there's gonna be shit like kebabs. Ooh, hell yeah, and steaks, the hot stuff, dude. I am so pumped. Meat, 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 meat. What about studying? Is there nothing but meat? <laughs> Well, duh, what else would you want? <laughs> sweets, 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 sweets! Dipper needs her cookie. Aw, oh, man, I can't stop thinking about meat. Piping hot, juicy meat. I've been cooking up a lot of meat lately, actually. I <laughs> Every night. Aw, oh, man, now I'm hungry. Let's get going already. I can't believe I was a vegetarian for a year. Why'd I do that? I think it was just to see if I could. Hmm. Hmm. Repetitive story, but I'll just share it anyways for those who are new. I thought it was a great idea to work at a meat shop while I was deciding to be a vegetarian. <laughs> Boy, did it kill me on the inside as they kept tasting all the new meat they kept slicing and be like, we gotta, we came up with a new flavor. And I was like, great. <laughs> what if she's the honor student? Oh, so what if? I should get special treatment. Someone's bitter. I heard the find of things might be from our school. I blame Mishima. I really blame Mishima. Yeet. It's somehow I know it's him. <laughs> I know it's his fault. I may not have proof, but I got the goods. <laughs> The irony. Well, it was the only summer job available at that time that paid well. It was over at Whole Foods. They didn't have space at the cashier. They didn't have space at the bakery. They didn't have space at the floral section. They had space at the meat section. I'm just like, yeah, okay, sure. <laughs> oh no, my worst nightmare! <laughs> Okay, no pressure. Okay, if angle C is 28 degrees and angle A and D are 88 degrees, what is the angle of B and C? What? Wait, how is, how is D 88 degrees? 
A looks so different. Maybe because it's longer. It's messing with my head. C is 28 degrees? Ah, oh, shit. Uh... <laughs> oh, no. Okay, hold on. 28. Let me give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second to math. <laughs> I don't even remember what am I. What, is there like a total number I'm supposed to think of that? Uh, hold on. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, 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 God, what's the number I'm thinking of to subtract with? <laughs> is the answer 64? It's 64. The answer C? Is the answer C? Is it my dream answer? Oh my god, it is! <laughs> okay, here's here. I'm, I'm actually big brain this one. 180 minus 116. Let's go. Ooh, we can do this. All right. <laughs> Oh my god. Let's see, an easy question. This looks tough. I feel like this is my redemption arc. <laughs> but let's calm down and think this through. Explain the origin of Bozai. Ah, oh, sh- well, there goes my redemption arc. Down to gutter. Okay, Bozai in this hot weather? Well, never mind. I think this came up in class. They were invented by that famous guy from Romance of the Three Kingdoms, right? I don't remember this. Uh, ha, 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 no, oh, no, oh, no, is it Huge Lang? Huge Lang, Huge Lang? Is it B? Is it Huge Lang? It's this, okay, Huge Lang, got it. You try and mess me up with this C. <laughs> okay, yeah, the strategy of shoe. Awesome. <laughs> I think the story was about a river overflowing somewhere. Uh, Huge Lang visited. There's, I, I bet this is not how you say his name. Is it, is it Zugi? Zuge? I don't know. And they were offering something to quell the river. <laughs> um, it was a barbarian's head, I think. Barbarian? Barbarian? Barbarian's head? Is it B? Is it B? Barbarian's head. Barbarian's head. All right, sweet. That's it. A crazy story. And that's how he came up with the Bozies. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> this master strategist came up with the Bozy to offer them instead of heads. To offer with the heads. To feed the survivors. To offer, uh, to offer with the heads. Is it B? There's a lot of B. Why is this all B? This test is messed up. Why is the answer not C? I'm seeing some A's and C's. Oh no, don't do this to me. Y'all trying to mess with my head with the C answers. A, 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 K, majority votes A, y'all. <laughs> yeah, I think they're right, okay. The Boji were invented as an offering to a river spirit to replace the tradition of offering several heads. I think this game's finally had it with me claiming that this game's always about C. <laughs> yep. You finish it. Ah, give it up. I hope Ann did okay. I'm gonna feel bad if she did bad. Now everyone. There's another test? Oh no. How many? It's a crab! I think. Ah, oh, shit. It's, um... Uh... 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 <laughs> it's, it's a red king crab? Red king crab? Red king crab? Is it, is it C? We finally got C! That sounds about right. What happened?
happened when the government issued paper and and hard currencies in Japan for the first time? It caused riots. The government collapsed. It caused confusion in the economy. Is the answer C? Come on, say it's C. Crab sticks. Crab cakes. Mmm. That's some good stuff. The first one's always C. <laughs> it's C. We got more C. Now we're getting our C's. That sounds about right. Yeah, let's go! <laughs> let's go Phantom Thieves Guild! This is the Chaos Crew Guild! Let's go! Let's get started. Man, he looks so smug. So cool that they actually asked they they added um dust particles here and there in the game. Okay, what is the English equivalent of the Norwegian idiom of reigning witches? Reigning dogs. Reigning cats and dogs. The answer is C! The answer is C! I don't need you guys for this one! I know it's this! The answer is C! Ooh, we can do this! Oh, let's go C! We're getting consecutive Cs! Let's go! <laughs> Which of the following is another name for the soma noodles traditionally eaten on ta Tanabata? The Milky Way! The Milky Way! Chloe! Seven! <laughs> Wait, what? Where's the Milky Way? Shit. Or or Orihimus. I don't uh Starry Canal? Stars? Star is it D? Starry Canal? It's, it's guts? It's guts. Oh, okay. It's guts. Demon guts. All right, not star related. My bad. Ooh, we can do this. Ooh, we we're doing it, boys. <laughs> Gotta eat some demon guts. <laughs> no, my Friday night. Damn these tests. Come, I keep missing my maid. Damn it. I really need to start working on my maid outfit. Oh, hey, speaking of maid outfits, do you guys want me to wear like a pink maid outfit or the traditional black and white maid outfit? Shit, that was hot. Whoa. You turned down the temperature on that one. Oof, oof, oof. All right, today's the last day. Yeah. <laughs> nice. <sighs> Oh, I don't have to do anything. <gasps> Saturday afternoon? My parents are gonna kill me. There was so much stuff on that exam. I didn't have time to study everything. Well, damn, sounds like your parents need to go make another kid now. They're gonna kill you. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I probably could have managed if I had an extra week, too. Mm, that means you procrastinated. An extra week, huh? The only people who get that kind of cushy treatment are the honor students. Uh, wow. What a presumptuous beesh. Oh, you mean like Yoshizawa-san. I heard the school moved her exam period. It must be nice getting perks like that. Oh my god. Oh, hey, look what they're- look what they're next to! You guys, look what they're next to. Emo, 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 emo the ladders. It's in the closest thing we got to pushing them down the stairs. <laughs> hey there. Oh, hey, cutie patootie. What you doing? Congrats on surviving finals. Today was the last day, right? Yeah, can I get a snack from your office? Say, would you happen to have some free time right now? Yes! I mean, yeah. There's something I'd like to discuss. <laughs> I promise it'll just take a moment. Oh my god, finally! Yes! Thanks. I know you're exhausted, so I'll make this quick. No, no, no. My energy just came back out of nowhere. <laughs> it sure has heated up now that the rainy season's passed. <laughs> Oh, 
Let me get this out of my system for a second there. I'm sorry for that jump scare. <laughs> okay, just imagine that. That small percentage for Monday stream. <clears throat> That's gonna be seven. Seven's gonna be a lot of that. Seven's gonna be a lot of yelling. <laughs> I just know my electric bill is going to start climbing this month. Anyway, as I've mentioned, there's something I'd like your opinion on. Uh, do you need counseling? <laughs> oh no, you know, I really do live the Joker life, man. This is just, just, what did I tell you about my counseling experience? Now I'm getting, now the Joker's getting Uno reversed over here. Do you need counseling? I'm gonna counsel this counselor. Let's go. I'm gonna listen to your troubles. Well, I suppose that's actually accurate. I'm here for you, dude. Just pay me in snacks at least, bare minimum. I've had something on my mind lately, and I want to hear your take on it. This is too real. This is too real. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, here goes. All right, I'm all ears. Oh, this is all hypothetical, mind you, but uh -huh. imagine there's somebody for whom you have high expectations. Oh, wow, that's putting a lot of pressure on that person. They're trying their absolute hardest to meet those expectations. That's not healthy. No. This person receives an awful lot of special treatment from people so they can perform to the best of their abilities. So, we're talking about Makoto. Let's just be upfront about it, shall we? <clears throat> so, what do you think those people will do if the expectations leveled on this person aren't met? Wait, what? What do you think those people are going will do if the expectation leveled on this person aren't met? So, if Makoto doesn't meet the expectations of others, what do I... What will they think? Uh... Oh my god, there's gonna be a variety of emotions. There's gonna be those who are the jealous... The jealous bitches. Saying, good. It's about time. She needs to get off her high horse. Things like that. The other option is, what is appointment? Uh... I feel like that'll probably be the most popular with the adults. Disappointment. Like... Oh, they'll be disappointed. There we go. <laughs> I love this game. I love this game. Oh my god. They'll turn on that person. They'll be disappointed. I don't want to think about it. So what do you think of this? I, don't... I feel like they'll be disappointed and they'll be and they'll turn on that person and are like the same thing. They're basically two negatives, just... They're basically at this... They're just like... <clears throat> they're both bad. They're both definitely the options over here. Um, this is the more aggressive one right here. They'll turn on that person. That's definitely a really aggressive option. Which is very popular in... And drama shows. So what we got over here? Uh, is this a point system or no? <laughs> it's probably the most honest. What, B? I mean, say basically tells Makoto that she's still a child and a drain on her, so in a way, she's turning on her too. That betrayal. They'll be disappointed, uh, reject her. Yeah, B is realistic. They're both realistic. Sounds like the point system. I don't think this scene, this scene has any confident point available, really? Hmm. Yeah, normally in anime shows, they usually go very drastic and do the turn on that person thing. It's just like... How could You're you? You're their expectations will turn into anger and scorn, right? Uh... 
anger, scorn, disappointment. There's a lot. It depends on the person, honestly. Yep, that's definitely true. It really depends on the person. When you work as a counselor. Basically, Makoto's been trapped with expectations. You know what's a real easy thing to do? Make them all have no expectations from you. Basically, fail, fail, fail until they give up on you and then just go do whatever you want. <laughs> you always think, I have to help this person so their heart doesn't break. But that's easier said than done. Preaching to the choir. This world really is a callous one. No matter how much positivity or dedication a person has, just a bit of influence from their peers can easily mess with their heads. I like to look at... It's a fascinating thing how trust and distrust form very differently. With trust, eh, for some people they give it away like candy, while others <clears throat> are, I guess, need time to build it. Um, I like to think of trust like glass. You... <laughs> Because once that trust is broken, you can try to repair it, but it ain't going to be the same. And you either just keep moving forward with that broken glass that you try to repair and try to make the most of it. Or you just let that broken glass lay there. Either way, once that trust is broken, it's not exactly the easiest thing to get back. Things change. Every time I'm confronted with such a situation, I can't help but grasp the limitations of therapy as a profession. Ooh, this guy's going deep. Ooh, go boy. Um, really, is reality is unfair. You just have to keep trying. This may not be the job for you. No, you just have to... I mean, I don't want to push you. If you don't want to do it, don't do it. Are you happy with your job? Why is that not an option? Reality is unfair. Reality is both fair and unfair. People get people are born into rich livelihoods while others get the short end of the stick. Uh but then again, no matter what your wealth is, anyone can get sick. Can like end up getting um uh, cancer for example. It doesn't matter how much wealth you have. But then again, reality does f is does feel unfair because if you have enough money, wealth it can cover treatment better than those who are poor, so... Okay, shoot, now reality is unfair. Damn! <laughs> Hold on! <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay, yeah, reality is unfair, live with it, do the best you can in it. <laughs> mm. Is there any point system in this one? I don't want to make him upset. Rain pours on everyone. Uh go with B. Yeah, it's keep keep just just keep trying, keep having faith. Oh, I'm not sick of this job or anything like that. Don't worry. Oh, I was just thinking that question. Good to know. <laughs> Sorry. I didn't mean to get all analytical. No, that's fine. It's usually fun to have this kind of talk every now and then. What I meant was, if we want to truly help people stuck in a predicament like that, we need a fundamental solution. A predicament like that? Uh, go ahead and let others be disappointed and just keep chugging. <laughs> and while she keeps having people having expectations on her, uh, she's gonna be trapped. So she just needs she just needs to break out of it and just go ahead and allow people get disappointed. She just needs to go ahead and just you know bash their expectations, break it down. She's in a box of expectations. Break your way out of it. A fundamental solution. 
Hmm. Nothing really comes to mind at the moment. I have a solution! Just go ahead and disappear these people! And just live your life! Otherwise, you're just walking on eggshells all the time. Irritating. This is just a thought, but what if we got the Phantom Thieves to change our hearts? I'm listening. Maybe have them shift our feelings so we won't lose to this unfair reality. It would ultimately be for the positive. Hmm. I love this man. <laughs> that sounds tough. Is that really a change of heart? I have no idea, but I just like that he's rooting for Team Phantom Thieves. <laughs> Yeah, no, it doesn't work that way, though. Sorry. <laughs> Good point. You're right. It's a cute thought, though. Sorry, I was just thinking out loud. It's a fine. It says it's, it's a fine. No, no problem. I think out loud, too. I seem to have lost track of the time. I should be getting back to my work. No! Keep talking to me! Our conversation's been very enlightening. It's been thank something. You. Uh, thank you. And enjoy your vacation. Where's my snack? Oh my god, my last day of school and I'm with you. Oh, be still my beating heart. Dun -dun, dun -dun, dun -dun, dun -dun. <laughs> Damn it! Exams are finally over. And I already oh, missed Maruki. So I don't care. I can get back to actually sleeping in peace. Hmm. You must have been studying pretty hard if it kept you up at night. Ooh, orange, yo! E Thank you so much for the gifted memberships! Nah, I was up playing video games. Slacking off is just too much fun. If he keeps talking to you once again, you're gonna miss Kawamama? From what I can see, I still got time. But, if I had to weigh my option between Maruki Sensei and Kawamama, I'm sorry. <laughs> Maruki is so freaking sweet. And he has snacks. I know, right? I kept cleaning my room instead of studying. I might even be too clean now. You two are perfect exemplars of what escapism can mean. Uh. <sighs> and I can only imagine what the end result will be. A C average, at least. Whatever! It's over with now! Who cares about that anymore? It's gonna be a problem if you failed. What's real important is the Phantom Thief's popularity. <laughs> Ain't it amazing? It kinda feels like our time's finally here. I've even heard people excitedly speculating about our next target. You will have to choose carefully. Let's go, Matt Mercer. <laughs> There's no need to hurry. We should spend some time thinking it over. Hold up! The most important thing now is our celebration party. I hope you guys didn't forget. It's the fireworks festival on the 18th. I guess we're good meeting up in Shibuya, yeah? Let's say 5 p.m. Uh, sure. We sure are on top of these kinds of things. Ryuji has the focus on his interests only. I can relate. I hate it. I am... I am Ryuji. <laughs> no! Not for real! <laughs> now for the weather. It seems we'll continue to have localized tor torrential rainstorms all through next week. If you're heading outside, be prepared for a sudden change in the weather. Oh boy. <sighs> the time just flew by today, huh? Ooh. <laughs> but 
Let's go to bed. Ah. Hey, hey. Uh oh. I'm gonna need some more soil. Hey! God, what a beautiful voice. Oh, come on. What? Ugh, Morgana. There are things I want to do with my time than just leave. Let's go to bed. Focus on Kamala Mama, you might get a nice reward in game soon. I mean, that's the goal. <laughs> I can't... I can't get Maruki Sensei, apparently. Makes me sad. Sorry for calling so late. I wanted to ask you for that summer festival. You remember the one I told you about? Yeah, you just told me earlier today. Uh, yeah, okay, let me see. Come on. Come on, man. Well, I know, so... Damn it, come on, the whole thing with the kebabs. Uh-huh. So, like... I completely spaced out on it until now, but the festival's tomorrow. Ah, okay. So you wanna go? Uh, yeah, yeah fine. Yeah. Hell yeah, I knew you'd be down. Let's make sure we invite Yusuke too. He's always down to chow. Wait, are we having a boys' night? Are we having a boys' night? Wait, hold on, now I'm excited. <laughs> Boys night! I did just remember they say it might rain tomorrow, though. We just wear raincoats. It's whatever. Yeah, exactly. It, whatever. No way it's gonna rain on a day like this. See you tomorrow. You just jinxed it. <sighs> How would he know whether or not it'll rain? Sheesh. All worked up over a silly little festival. Full of food. Of all kinds. Oh, you're gonna be into it, Morgana, when you see it tomorrow. Well, I suppose you deserve to enjoy yourself, but be sure to keep a low profile, alright? Let's turn in for the night. Uh, let's see if, uh, knock on wood, we meet Kawamama there at the uh, festival, too. We're gonna bump into somebody. Oh, and, uh, no sleeping in. Got it. I'm gonna skip breakfast for tomorrow. <laughs> We're gonna trying to act cool. Uh, funny. He's a funny kitty. What's up? Oh, good, you're not in your, your school uniform. Thank you. My god, Yusuke, you're so petite. We need to feed this boy. Mm. Why? why? Why are you staring at my face? He's got a... Mm. Why? Ryuji, I have a favor to ask. Oh, it's his thinking face. A favor? Sure, you need some money for food or something? <laughs> not this time. I've actually been mulling over a new battle tactic for a while now. Oh, Yusuke and Ryuji battle. Okay. And I'd like for you to lend a hand in bringing my idea to fruition. Why is no one asking me? Oh, a new move? That sounds badass. I totally want in. Wait, Ryuji's get two new moves with Yusuke and with, um, with Makoto? What's that? What's going on here? Well, it's merely a rough idea at this point, but I like how they're color coordinated with their um with their uh affinity, their their themed magic. Blue on Yusuke for ice, yellow on Ryuji for the lightning, on with red for her fire. I like it. What do you think? Wasn't that like Way more detailed than some rough idea. He's been thinking about it a lot. That's so funny. Huh. Well, I don't deserve such praise. Wow, he's gay. <laughs> I would merely prefer to add a splash of beauty to an otherwise barbaric battlefield, so to speak. Sick. So uh, all we got to do now is see how the star reacts to your idea, right? Yeah, I haven't seen the Makoto one yet, either. They're both a secret. We should consult Jose about this soon. Jose. However, I can feel my appetite growing after describing my idea. <clears throat> Your appetite growing? 
Same here. You're hungry. You're growing boys. Heat wave? Oh no. It's so hot. Oh, why are we not wearing sun hats or anything? <gasps> but look at all the food! Ice cream, kebabs, hot dogs, steak, Coca-Cola? Mmm. It's as if we're walking around in an enormous sauna. Whose bright idea was it to come here? It was yours! Yours. And just look at that crowd. Smiling faces everywhere you look. With that, let's move right into asking some of the visitors here for their comments. A TV crew, huh? Mm, we better not stand out. <laughs> we can't end up on TV. We should grab our kebabs and get out of here. Ah, let's interview those three. Ah, damn it. Hey, is she talking about us? Just walk away. Just walk away. Just walk away. What the? What do we do? Walk away. <laughs> let's make a run for it. <laughs> that would just make us appear even more suspicious. Damn it. <laughs> it was the next It was the closest thing to walking away. They got us. Oh shoot. Oh hell. Okay, I'm gonna ham it up, make some real cringy comments, I can't use any of the footage. Hello. It sure is hot today, huh? Oh, for sure. <laughs> yeah. And if it's this hot in July, can you imagine just how insane the weather's gonna be in December? Unrelated. Uh anyway. <laughs> Since you're here for the festival, does that mean you and your friends there are meat lovers? Wait, 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 wait. Why is Ryuji speaking? Why is who let Ryuji speak? Who let Ryuji speak? Don't let this boy speak. He's going to reveal we're the Phantom Thieves. Uh You read you just shut up and say you've got to go to the bathroom or something. I'd say that we're really lovers of fruit. No, oh, and sweets. <laughs> sweets are just to die for. You said you like meat. Why are you lying? <laughs> huh? W what's going on here? Well, uh, thank you very much for your time. Oh my god, Ryuji didn't. Ryuji'd. Ooh, that was too close. What? Well, I'm impressed! That was truly cringeworthy. But are you certain that they won't air any of it? <clears throat> Let it be cringy! I don't care, as long as he didn't reveal our secret. Pretty sure she thought there was a broadcast disaster. We ought to be okay. More important than that, though, it's time to get some meat. Meat. Oh, right, my kebab. He's lying to be cringy. Yeah, no, I I picked that up later <laughs> with that. <laughs> he was cringy on purpose. That way they'll leave. I'm guilty of doing that every now and then. Have you guys ever done that where you just like deliberately become super awkward just so you can get out of something? The lines for the food stalls were even more insane than the heat. Standing around in this sweltering heat was rather trying. And almost all the good stuff was already sold out. Aw, oh, unfortunate. I didn't even eat breakfast this morning. We didn't get meat. We're starting we to get lightheaded. Oh no! Even still, an occasion like this seems to make everything taste delicious. Huh? How mysterious? It's because we're together. Yeah. I really wanted a kebab. The boy needs me. I don't want him to. It's because we're together. The power of friendship. That's pretty poetic, dude. I know. I've got a poetic heart. Well, we came all the way out here, so we might as well go check that thing out. I really want that kebab, but the boy needs meat. What thing? I heard they're building some kind of huge-ass stadium or something nearby. Wait, is that what it was? You don't know what you're talking about, do you? A stadium? 
Well, such buildings often have intriguing architecture. I'd love to see it for personal reference. Yeah, then come on, let's go. So that's it? This is something? It barely even started? We seem to be premature spectators. <laughs> I guess this is what people call jumping the gum. The gun. It's the gun, Ryuji. <laughs> jumping the gun. Eh, there ain't nothing to do here. You want to go grab a bite somewhere? Sorry, I'm considering picking up more art supplies. I have a summer assignment to work on. Wait, Yusuke, you need to eat more, boy. Also, the summer festival drained my coffers. Even if I did grab a bite, all I could order would be water and a hot towel. Oh, can when I give you money? Ah, uh, now in that case, probably ought to just call it quits for today. Hmm? What'd you spot? Hey, isn't that Yoshizawa? Huh. What you doing? Don't you think she's acting strange? You know, she did mention something about a meat earlier. What an interesting twist if it was um, the gymnast there that was the uh, the one that was causing accidents. That would be such a twist. She going in messing with people in mementos. <laughs> uh, ain't you guys headed home? Uh, I've got something to do. Go on ahead without me. Well, see you then. Yep. Yes, catch you later. Senpai? Hi, what you doing here? <laughs> what a pleasant surprise. Yes, uh, did you come to see the stadium too? Ye. Yeah. Same here. I needed to give myself a pep talk. Oh. Uh... Something wrong? Sometimes, when things get me down, I come here. Weird. Although, that doesn't really answer your question, does it? Mm. I know this may get in the way of your plans, but would you be willing to join me for lunch? I could... Yeah. I am a dude, and I know dude has bottomless pit of a stomach. <laughs> I have more... F I have room for more food! <laughs> Kasumi's eyes look a little red and puffy. Oh, shit, she been crying? It may be best to accompany her. Yeah. Unless... Whew, that was delicious. Was that all you, eating? All the plates are on your end. Where's my plate? What did I just witness? You should pack it away. Yeah, I know. <laughs> like this after a meet oh wow got i guess i mean makes sense you gotta recuperate those calories in all honesty i'd like to keep going but any more will end up harming my performance okay so the meat's done <laughs> was it worth it simply put it was a disaster uh what happened been feeling like I'm getting back into the natural flow of things thanks to you senpai okay but when the moment of truth arrived my body still wouldn't move the way that I wanted it to oh no the classic peer pressure when you're in front of everyone girl been there that sounds rough is it more of a mental thing I think that's a big factor yeah it's totally a mental thing Something similar happened to me in middle school, but back then, I had someone by my side that kept me going. Sounds like you want me by your side to keep you going. I'm getting some hints. <laughs> uh, who do you mean? I'm nosy. <laughs> Too nosy? My bad. I have a younger sister. Oh. We promised each other that we'd win international gymnastics competitions together. Ah, oh, the motivation, the family support system. But this spring, 
she died in an accident. Oh my god! Here I am sipping my tea and you're telling me this sad story? Ah, uh, Oh, that's oof, rough. Rough. I am so sorry. My condolences. Oh, there's that music. I promised her we'd take the gold for our routines across the world. Too much pressure. But I can't stop worrying about my lack of improvement lately. Oh, no. I've really been throwing myself into practice. But I wonder if even that won't be enough. You're thinking too much. Do you want to go get some drinks? I'm sure some... Somewhere there's some weird party going on. <laughs> Actually, it's a terrible idea. Don't listen to me. You need a distraction. Uh, you really are doing your best. It's not over yet. Is this really your limit? Uh, it, it's not over yet. Uh, what was the question again? I've really been throwing my blank practice, but I wonder if that won't be enough. Uh, uh, A or B, A or B, A or B, A or B. It's not over yet. Don't give up! <laughs> it's A? In fact, there was a real sad, uh, car accident last month. Oh. Okay. You're doing your best. Senpai. Thank you for being so thoughtful. Where's my note? Where's my point? You just keep on rescuing me, don't you? God damn it, the trade's not fair. Where's my point? <laughs> okay, no more brooding. That's okay, I guess. There are still more meats left this year. I'm going to start from scratch and train as hard as I can. Okay. Thank you so much for listening to all that. Okay. Now I feel like I've been recharged. Mind, body, and spirit. Cool. <laughs> are you still hungry? Well, at least my mind and spirit are recharged. Oh, girl. Alright. We should have gone to a buffet. I would love to see how many plates you would have consumed. The best way to stave off hunger is with some vigorous activity. I'm going to jog home. Take care. Wait, I thought you were still hungry. Was that an upset stomach? You're jogging home in your sandals? You're gonna rip them. Lady, those are not jogging shoes. <laughs> You're going I thought you were trying to be safe with your body. <laughs> Holy she. They seem dangerous. Oh no! Was that an F word on here? Apparently, if you post a request on the forum, they'll do what you say. I hope YouTube doesn't see that. If they're taking out bad guys, it's fine by me. Keep it up. Dem thieves. A plus. <laughs> Why do we need the police anymore? Oh, boy. Ah, you're back. She has a spare in her bag. Oh, clever girl. Oh! Mmm. You! How could you, doghouse? What did I do? Wait, hold on. What, like, yeah, how could I what? If you're going to the summer festival, why didn't you invite me? Oh, no. You're. No. No. No! Invite me to everything that you're doing. Oh no, you're that person. No, why you gotta go make things awkward like this? I didn't like it. <laughs> I don't like it. Yo, Blue, thank you so much for the gifted memberships, man. Stay awesome. Thank you, thank you. Oh, like you guys don't ha have never been in this position. When like a rant, when your friend just like wants to start guilt tripping you and be like, how could you? And be like, how could I what? How could you make a decision without me? Like, can I not do things without you, please? 
This is triggering me. <laughs> My god. What did you say? How does Mishima even know about that? The TV. They're showing it on the TV. Okay, cool. Something about it being hot in December or saying sweets are to die for. There's a bit with Sakamoto saying some really crazy stuff. Uh, you were saying things. Believe me, I wanted to think that. Look, my point is next time you guys are going out to have fun, can't I come along too? So freaking pushy, I hate this. I'm gonna take a bathroom break. <laughs> I've been meaning to, to, to wanting to go to the bathroom. This seems like a perfect opportunity. Ah, Mishima. All right, I am back. Um, I am so curious. Have you guys been in a situation like this? Because I swear, people like Mishima are part of the reason why I have high social anxiety now. Because this was nonstop back in high school for me. How could you do that? Why didn't you include me? Why da 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 blah 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 And I'm like, oh my god, am I an awful person? It's like I didn't realize what I was doing was bad. <laughs> like I just wanted to have my own private thing, my own private thing. <laughs> I didn't realize everything I need to do, I need to share it with people. It messed with my head. It really messed with my head. So I get I get so iffy with my decisions and it's just like it slowly made me want to push people away because I just 
I just thought I was a constant disappointment for them. It's like, I can't do anything right. I'm just going to make you upset. It, it, <laughs> so yeah, I'm I, I'm trying to lightheart the mood with Mishima here, but this, is, this kind of guy literally is a trigger for me. Oh my god. It's insane. Some, some people can handle it. Some people can handle it just fine. But because I didn't learn words like no or... Uh, or like defend myself or didn't really understand about like having boundaries are okay. Um, this, this, this kind of like, this kind of person would always like send me to like me doing things I'm not comfortable with or I don't want to, but I just do it just to like be nice, if that makes any sense. It's like, it's not a sincere action that I am doing. So a lot of things that I wanted to enjoy, I was faking it. <laughs> Which is wrong. It is totally wrong. So it's just like, I was like, I can't handle this. I need to get away. <laughs> and some people, and this may not be a huge thing for people. Like they can just like easily explain and be like, yo, dude, you know, some space. <laughs> I'll invite you when I will. It's that easy. It's that easy. Like to say in action, in theory, right here. I could... But in that moment, <laughs> in the moments, really, it really is just to kind of give people like the 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 news of like, hey, this is gonna hurt your feelings, but. Ah, <laughs> uh, all right. Anyways, back to the game. I have a feeling a lot of people are going to dis- not a lot, but a good portion of people are going to disagree with me and be like, well, that's just mean. Look, all I'm saying is that different types of people are for different types of people. But Mishina, Mishima type is not for my personality type. That's all I'm saying. I can't handle this. <laughs> I'm the Phantom Thieves producer, you know. So you have the right to my to what I do in my daily activity. Oh, I swear to God! All right, I'm gonna stop. I just keep keep moving. Oh man! Are you kidding me? I hope Lady Anne and the others haven't found out. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Are they gonna call me next? Oh God! I hope I don't get a flood of messages from them. Please no. Oh hey! You want to see a movie? Oh, all fair. Uh, yo. Oh, I think I was supposed to do a thing. Oh my god, there's so many things. What is happening here? Hmm? Years ago, I had a friend that would get upset if I hung out with my girlfriend without him. Oh my god. That's, that's too much, in my opinion. One thing to learn is that other fantasy and wants is the pro is their problem. If you want it, you can ask, but always remember that no is always is also an answer. Yeah. <laughs> we are human. Always upset some others. Yeah. No. There is no way you can get through life without without upsetting someone. That is that is a fact. There is. No amount of you trying to do things right, quote unquote, is going to make you avoid, like, upsetting someone. Someone is always going to get upset with, upset with you, no matter what. Even when you do nothing, they're going to get upset with you. <laughs> Thanks to the internet, I feel like I can get my sanity back. <laughs> Alright, anyways. Feel like a movie? Everyone's buzzing about the summer debut. Everyone's talking about the chick flicks love possibly. You want to watch it with me? I get kind of I get kind of weepy, so it's embarrassing to go alone. Can you come with me? Come and watch it with me. Oh my gosh. Ah, uh, sounds like a date. Ooh, gunman. Yo. <laughs> I didn't think it was gonna trigger me so much with Mishima. Oh, <laughs> I now get like this chest pain, like this, like this scare whenever I get text messages. I'm like, oh my god, who is that? <laughs> it's an unhealthy solution what I did, but like, I have done 
majority of what I could in my power to lower expectations uh, with people. I want them to have low or no expectations from me. It's more relaxing for me. I don't know if that makes any sense or not. <laughs> Yo, gun enthusiast. Stop by the shop if you can. Ooh. This, this is a lot of options. What's happening? Celebrity festival photo. Here's a commemorative photo from the summer festival. At least that was the idea. Oh, that's so cool. It's certainly evocative. Well, don't let it get to you. Shit happens. <laughs> It's understandable, given the heat. Perhaps your hands grew sweaty and it slipped. Next time we'll make sure we go somewhere we can actually eat and take a proper picture together. Memories. Agreed. I prefer an indoor establishment myself. Preferably one with ample seating and free refills on, on water. Ugh, that'd just be the diner again. And why not? <laughs> oh my god, ample eating and free refills. Gross. <laughs> Yusuke. It's a place of calm where one may also partake of delicious food. I mean, I guess? Man, all this talk about food's got me hungry. A cup Rama would hit the spot. I believe I shall do the same. Fortunately, I recently required a some high quality bread crusts. Sorry. Oh no, sorry I couldn't catch it for you. I always forget how short my arms are as a cat. Oh, it's okay, Morgana. Okay, that was a fun chat with the boys. Ooh, okay, so. Date night with a girl or or gunman? Date night with girl or gunman? Date night with girl or gunman? What do y'all think? What do y'all think since you're like all persona pros? If it was me, I would go with on. Because I don't understand the importance of gunman. <laughs> Reminder that Mishima is the best perk in the game. I think they did it deliberately. It's so mean. It is so mean that they did that. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, on is for tomorrow. Gun dad today. Wait, on's tomorrow? Check TV and on. TV? Wouldn't they say there's stuff to do on the TV if there was? Okay, hot, hot and juicy. Let's check how the summer festival went. Start the video. And if it's this hot in July, can you imagine how just how insane the weather's gonna be in December? I say that we're really, we're really lovers of fruit. Oh, and sweets. Sweets are just to die for. Oh no, it's Ryuji. <laughs> Ryuji's answering the interviewer. For real? For real? Oh man, in the end, they still decided to use that footage. Wow. I guess they were in a rush. Okay. Oops. I should write something. Uh, oh yeah, you know what? That was an accident, but I should save. Juice! Oh my god, you're right! I can get a smoothie! Nice! Um, that's, uh, underground walkway. Thank you! Sundays is dad time. Gun dad on Sundays? A date with like Tifa? <laughs> Jake and I end up going out with another girl or Barrett. I'm I will weep. <laughs> I will weep. Welcome. Would you like some fresh fruit juice? Since today is Sunday, we'll also have yes, 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 please. Juice me. Juice me up, please. So Sunday's gun dad. Alright. Nice. Alright, alright. So smart. God, I don't know what to should I work on my proficiency or charm next? Ooh. Anyways. Alright, gun dad. What are we doing? He wanted me to do work for him or something. Okay, hurry up. Yeah, okay. Howdy. Howdy! 
Gun dead, confident, gives more and better weapons. Oh, give me more violent. Let's go. More violent from the next palace, please. Yeah. Regardless of the weather outside, I gotta run the AC so my merch stays in good condition. If it's too cold for you, just put on a jacket, kid. So you're here because you saw my message, right? You did message me, so yeah. <laughs> I want to work. Uh, yeah, sure, okay. Give me the work. There's a job I need you to do. Don't worry, it ain't that difficult. I'm sure you can handle it. That's what they all say! How many datables are there? There's at least 10? Oh my god, that's a lot. Why? Why do they make that many? You have to play this game like 10 times so you can do a date for each one. Oh no. <laughs> How many of y'all did that? How many of you guys committed to Persona and playing the game over and over again so you can get different endings with your dates? Or maybe it's not even a different ending, but... You do end up with someone or you do a harm, if I understand? You don't have to answer like the spoiler, like I think that makes spoilers. I'm, I'm making an assumption here. But I guess like how much replay did you guys do? <laughs> show me, show me your hours. No shame everybody, share your hours. Let the, let the Persona fans know. <laughs> don't worry, it ain't that difficult, kid. Okay. Looks like I'm hanging out with him. Wait, no, I didn't check my person. Oh, I forgot to get my persona. I'm gonna meet up with a guy at the diner after this. I need you to sit close by. When I give you the signal, call me. The, the signal is when I cough. Got it? Let's go. Okay, sounds easy enough. Well, I'm gonna walk around. Okay. Ugh. Four hundred to five hundred hours, two hundred hours, two hundred, three hundred, three hundred. Come on, who's the winner? Nine hundred hours? I think we found a winner. I see I see nine hundred. Wow. Over nine hundred. Damn. I'm gonna ask if it was worth it, but with this game I'm with the game I'm playing right now, I'll be like, hell yeah, I bet it was worth it. No question. Oh my god, we played it like 20 times now. Wow! <laughs> A thousand! Impressive! <laughs> A diner, huh? I thought only old farts come to places like this. What? You really changed, Mune. <laughs> oh, hey, don't knock this place. It's pretty decent and cheap too. Ah, uh, this is coming from the guy who beat the crap out of 50 rival gang members. Oh man, badass. You don't need to exaggerate. Anyways, what do you want to talk about? So is this guy, he was, was he part of a gang or something? Yeah. All right. How's Suda-san doing? Same as always. Why, what's up? Oh, nothing. Just saw him around the other day. Hold up, didn't you two cut ties when you left the family? Why are you asking about him now? I mean, we were both young. I just figured it's about time we bury the hatchet. I can't just go up and talk to him though. Ah, I getcha, you're still trying to uphold the old code of honor, huh? Okay, I'll tell him what you want that you want to meet up. Don't say stupid shit like that. Whoa! No, you fool. I just want to end up in the same place at the same time. It's gotta... It's gotta look like a coincidence. This is a lot of work. Why don't you just want to meet him up? Meet up with him. Blah, blah, blah. He was part of the Yakuza? Yeah, I, I get... I'm, I'm betting the uh, Yakuza brand is on his neck. The tattoo. In that case, Shibo, Shibora might work. You know, we're talking about the redeveloping it. Shibura. <laughs> I'm sick. <laughs> huh? You sick or something? 
Nah, it's just a cold. Hello? Yeah, how's it going? What? Your order's all wrong? My bad. I'll get back and take care of that straight away. Sorry. Hey, sorry, I gotta run. Work shit. Let's talk some other time, yeah? Nah, I see ya. Hey. Don't hang up. Masa's still on the phone, right? Just stay quiet so I can hear what he's saying. <laughs> this is exciting. Sudasan, it's Masa. Iwa was asking about you. I did just like you told me though. It's a setup. The hell are you looking at? Joker, why are you looking? I was daydreaming, sorry. <laughs> nah, it's nothing. Just some weird kid staring at me. I was looking into your beautiful eyes. <laughs> and I just got lost in them. Anyways, Iwa probably heard about that deal of yours. And now he's trying to squeeze some cash out of you. Mm, really? Oh, sorry. No, it's... Yes, sorry. Yeah, okay. I understand. A deal. Sounds like there's some weird stuff going down. Who was that guy? What should I do now? How's your cold? <laughs> Please tell me this is not a point system right here. Can I answer with C? Please tell me I can answer with C. This is a point system? Come on. I just need someone to tell me if this is a point system or not. <laughs> hey! <laughs> I hate feeling restrained. No points? Yes! How's your cold? It seemed real bad. <laughs> oh, whoa! You just said there's no point system! <laughs> You lied to me! <laughs> You're seriously naive, kid. You know what? I take that at me. Yeah, I'm naive. <laughs> oh, there was a point system. So C was it. Okay. <laughs> you know I was acting, right? <laughs> This is definitely a, like, you're so pretty moment. <laughs> At any rate, I honestly wasn't expecting too much out of you. <laughs> but it looks like you're gonna actually be some use to me. I'll be counting on you, kid. I feel like my bond is growing deeper. Ah. All right. Cool. I didn't say there was no point system. I can't read. <laughs> Good work today. Order yourself something nice as a re as a reward. Oh, today's a win. I get free dinner. Oh, and bring me the receipt so I can pay you back for it. Later. Oh, you're so cool. Ooh, I feel like helping you out with my work has honed my proficiency. I need that to dodge my bullet chalk attacks from the teacher. Oh, that's a lot of proficiency. Let's go. I need to, I need more than just skills. I need to be the master in proficiency. Both How's your cold and what should I do now gave the same points. Okay, I'm definitely, <laughs> thank you for sharing. I'm definitely getting the, uh, you're so pretty vibe from uh, Iwa-san. All right, I know how to behave with him now. <laughs> if you don't get the joke, uh, what I'm trying to say is that like, you meet someone who's just like not picking up what you're saying or, you know, showing like naive or a dumb moment or something like that. <laughs> Me and my sister do that to each other all the time whenever we have our little bloop moment. And it's just like, and my sister's just like, aw, you're so pretty. <laughs> I'm just like, huh? 
Wait, what? What I miss? <laughs> Yo, Blood Knight, thank you so much for the gifted memberships. Yo, enjoy the emotes if you haven't been a member before. And my embarrassing videos on the side that I try to hide from everybody. <laughs> Hello, Doghouse. That's me. Chaos different, becoming more chaotic. Am I? I feel like I have the same level. I feel like I'm less chaotic compared to last week. I feel a little bit more tamed today. Thank you so much for earlier. Now I can give it 110% tomorrow at practice. You're not going to rest? Nope, if I take a day off, I'll dull my senses, but there's also things like overworking your muscles too. Next meet, I'll make it into the winner's podium. I swear, okay. I won't slip up again like I did before, okay. I'll have some great news next time I see you, I promise, okay. Looks like Yoshizawa is going to be okay now. Okay. Heh. <laughs> she sure had us worried. I'm never gonna meet my... My waifu. <laughs> How many weeks has it been since I've seen my wife? My future waifu? It's been too long. Oh god. Muscle fatigue is real. It is. Today's the fireworks festival. It's me in Shibuya at 5. Hey, Makoto, are you going to wear a yukata? I'm planning on it. Ooh. Yukatas are great part of the summer tradition. They, are tr they truly heighten a woman's beauty. I think I'll wear mine as well. You've got one? How about you, Dipper? Pff, dude. No. I don't have a yukata. Hey, I know. Why don't you come without your glasses? Oh, that's a big difference. Wait, no! Don't! That's too much riz! Look how- look- look at me! Look at me! The glasses are necessary! If I take off the glasses, it's too cute! I'm too cute! <laughs> Gosh, it's summer too, so I should probably like get in my summer clothes as well. Ooh, so hot. So hot. I should probably put up my hair too. Man, it's so hot. So hot. <laughs> What's the point in that? I don't know. You don't get to see fireworks every day. So it'd be sad just wearing normal clothes. I was just thinking he might want to go for a change of pace. I never knew taking off my glasses would make such a, di such a big difference. <laughs> right, the fortune teller. I keep forgetting. Fortune is commit or ignore. Part way is not worth it. So did I just miss out on the fortune event? Did I, did I miss out? Oops. <laughs> uh, that's great. Uh, you should totally come without glasses. Well, you guys better not be late. Oh boy. Alright, let's go with glasses for now. Aw, oh, jeez. Aw, oh, jeez. Fireworks and Yukatas really add to the feeling of summer. Even Lady Anna will be wearing one. Come to think of it. Oh yeah, there's a fireworks festival today. If you're going, be careful. Those things get insanely crowded. Hey, hey. Yeah? It'd be nice to watch the fireworks with the chief today. Oh, someday. We could watch them right here at LeBlanc. Actually, no, we couldn't. Ah. Uh, not yet? Okay. Yeah, I haven't had exactly had time to myself these past couple of days. Right when we were just about to leave, too. Who is it? I don't know. I'm out! I'm out! No! Yeah, I saw something disturbing on news online. Oh, shoot. Wait, what's this? It sounds like it'll be it'll be really bad if it turns out true. Okay, what? what, what? I'm in a hurry. <laughs> oh, sorry. Well, it seems like an insane group is getting ready to declare war on the Phantom Thieves. Oh, shoot. 
Okay, that's actually quite important, I guess. Well, now I feel like an ass. <laughs> I was afraid to just hold on to that information myself, so I wanted to tell you at least. <laughs> That's actually all I have to say, though. Sorry to bother you on your odd day. <laughs> I feel bad now. What could he mean by an insane group? Oh, no. <laughs> well, let's think about this after we get back. We don't have much time, so let's get going. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. This <laughs> dipper's true love. No, Blood Knight! <laughs> Damn, it's so hot. So many people. Ooh, who's that cute girl next to me? The holiday means it's as crowded on here as it is for morning rush hour. Now for today's train news. Today headlines are... Fireworks festival tonight. Expect roads and transportation to be congested for the entire day. Sudden weather changes in imminent. Be careful of sudden shifts in climate from afternoon to night. Wait, so all these people are going to the fireworks festival? It's gonna get crowded. Ugh, this should be fun. Yeah, I'm not exactly ecstatic when it comes to crowds either. So hot. Man, me and Ryuji, we need to go shopping. We're wearing the same clothes over and over again. I feel like I'm being baked. Into a cookie, I hope. Those girls are way too late. It must be taking time for them to put on the yukata. I wonder what they're going to look like. Wearing one? We don't own any. Got clothes like you, Kata. Man, you look way too normal in that. It's fitting for him. Honestly, I hope he stays in Yukata instead. People often say that to me. <laughs> He's aware. Oh, by the way, the exams. What kind of bait? Cookie, because we're gonna look so sweet and cute. I don't know. Blame <laughs> response. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah, he doesn't have any glasses right now. I must reveal. Ta da! Actually, let me get my, my original hairstyle down. Yeah, there we go. I bet you got a big fat F on them. Wow, Morgana. Shut up. We we don't know that yet. Are you going to the fireworks festival? Uh, girl? That's right. Us too. Want to go together? I'm sorry. Are you asking Yusuke when I'm standing here? Hold on. Are we getting hit on? Oh, are you asking on all of us? Ooh. Ooh, okay. <laughs> Come on, let's go together. Okay. Do you happen to be a model? You look great in that yukata. Wait, no, they are focusing on Yusuke. Are you telling me Yusuke's got more riz than me? What kind of bullshit is this? What? Waiting around's a pain, so can we just go with these chicks? Uh. Don't ask me. No way. Let me think about it. I, they're not asking. They're not asking me. I don't know. I have to think about it. I don't know if I want to go with these girls. They're they're ignoring me. Let me think about it. A chance like this never comes up. Yeah, I know. But Yusuke is the one who's getting hit on. I don't want to be at nobody's lackey. <laughs> That's enough. Oh. You're disgracing your yukata. You should be more aware of your womanhood. Whoa! How could you? My man, Yusuke. Yeah, send them, send those girls away. They, they didn't know how to choose a guy. 
don't you go after them then? So those are the kinds of girls you like, Ryuji. <laughs> They're not impressed. It's definitely a this moment. Hmm. Uh, well, no, that, that, that's... You know, Yusuke's such a pretty boy, but he is really missing out because of what he says. <laughs> I guess. But he's more likable since he stays true to his ideals. Definitely more than somebody I know. I heard that Ryuji's pretty much failed his exams. Oh? <laughs> Mona, you little... <laughs> hey, it's gonna get crowded if we don't get going. Agreed. But, man, you both look amazing in Yukata. <laughs> Talk about Japanese beauty. Goodbye, Ryuji. This is funny. Woo! I look so pretty. <laughs> oh no. I guess that's it. I'm standing right next to Yusuke. Come on. I look prettier than him. I'm the pretty boy. <laughs> yeah. Hmm? Uh. <laughs> Come on. Looks like you need help. Then yeah. why don't you go buy me a towel already, huh? Ah. Uh. <laughs> Show a little leg. A flood warning. Floof? Floof? I didn't think we were gonna see floof. Yeah. We we're just trying to get out of the rain, but look how crowded it is. Wow. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I guess everyone had the same idea. What's up? Hmm. I think I just saw someone I know. You mean the girl in that black car? Well, she's got a ride. Oh, time to show your skills, Mona. We need you as a car. <laughs> it's not possible in the real world. My feet hurt. It's cold. Festival's been canceled. This sucks. Ooh, is that a meat bun? You're stressed out. Go eat something. <laughs> oh, we made such a commotion with the public, and this is what we get? <sighs> Lame. Aren't heroes that lurk in the shadows boring? Oh man, Ryuji, you really like to you really want to be in a spotlight. Aww. This boy wants attention. Huh. Fried rice. Yum yum. They keep talking about food. How can I resist not eating? <laughs> I like the shade. What are you, Moss? Yes. I want to change the world with a loud bang, like a huge firework. Then again, we aren't going to find someone bigger than Kanashiro that easily. The rain is letting up. Though it's regrettable, we should go our separate ways for today. Yeah, let's go home. So you won't tell me, no matter what. Uh-oh. I have nothing more to say to you about that. I see. In that case, I have ways of making you talk. Uh-oh. Huh? What's that supposed to Thanks for the drink. Hey, no, hold on. Say, I know you are sexy and hot. And a lot of things make people feel something. 
<laughs> but how dare you threaten my dad? Hey, we're not done here yet. Damn, she's working that suit. I'm home. <laughs> What's wrong? I don't even know if he's gonna tell me anything or not. I'm home. Hi. Yeah, that's obvious. Mm -hmm. It's past closing time. Clean up the place. Regrettably, the cause behind the recent psychotic breakdown incidents is still unknown. The answer is, oh, that, you know what? That was a missed opportunity. I should have done Love Us Quarrel. My bad. I was not in a uh, be a joker mood that moment. <laughs> On to other news. The international hacktivist group Medjid has released a statement to the Phantom Thieves. Hmm? Hmm? These are the details of the message that are posted on Medjid's website. To the phantom thieves causing an uproar in Japan. Do not speak of your false justice. We do not need the spread of such falsehood. We are the true executors of justice. Oh no, is it the government? Phantom thieves again? However, we are magnanimous. We will give you an opportunity to repent your ways. It's the government. If you agree to a change of heart, we will accept you as our own. Wait, what? If you reject our offer, the hammer of justice will find you. It's the it's the government. Justice, huh? We are Medjid. We are unseen. We will eliminate evil. Akechi-san, why do you think this announcement was made at this time? Oh. I don't know the details, but there's no doubt that they were provoked by the Phantom Thieves. Whether it's a sense of rivalry or a simple attention grab, given the recent trends, I cannot say. Regardless, it's quite a nuisance. A nuisance? Both Mejed and the Phantom Thieves are nothing more than groups that uphold an egoistic justice. What a stupid thing they're getting riled up on. Phantom Thieves, huh? What in the world are they? You know about them? I have the right to remain silent. <laughs> I'm not interested. Close enough. Can't you even take part in small talk? You should have more interest in what's going on with the world. Oh, right. I forgot point system there for a second. Uh-oh. It's about time I go home. Sorry to upset you, Sojiro. I'm sorry, Dad. Make sure you lock the place up. Also, about the stuff in the fridge. Eat it before it goes bad? Well, I guess it's fine. Just don't use too much of it. Okay, eat it before it goes bad. Got it. Thanks for letting me eat. It's possible that more people like these will continue to appear due to their influence. In that respect, the Phantom Thieves face a very serious crime. Oh, I'm good? Cool. Hackers declared war on the Phantom Thieves? This is getting interesting. But why? Did the Phantom Thieves do something to them? Midjid. I'm looking forward to seeing how the Phantom Thieves will deal with it. We're doing with an unknown enemy. I have a new message from the Phantom Thieves chat room. We gotta talk about Medjed. You mean those guys people uh, online are going nuts over? Medjed. That name seems to come from one of the obscure gods from the Egyptian books of the dead. I saw the news. For some reason they think we speak of false justice. Now then, what exactly did you want to speak of regarding Medjed? Well, we don't want to go. We don't. Why don't we go after them as our next target? Since they're on our backs. What a sudden suggestion. 
I mean, they're like bad hackers or something, right? Technically, they're crackers. Oh. Those who use the internet to illegally access and alter data. Meja is an organized group of such people re recognized by the larger international community. Wow, this is big. So they operate on a global scale? That makes them even bigger than Kaneshiro. Right? Then it's settled. Our next target's gonna be Medjet. I this seems like we're playing with real not even fire anymore. I feel like we're we're messing around with like acid. This is like this is real bad. I wonder if the naval will get a hit if we Oh, the nav will get a hit if we put Medjet in. Oh right. Uh, let's try it out. That would be impossible. Uh, okay. It has to be a pseudonym. Um, su pseudonym? We don't even know how many people Medjet is. Oh. Man, Makoto got this a lot faster than me. <laughs> Wouldn't we get at least one member's info if we try and look into it? Uh, and look into it though. Even if, even if we did, how would we discover the location? The only confirmed presence of Medjet has been online. This is a greater problem than simply finding their keywords. Unless you have any more ideas, Ryuji. <laughs> Hello! It seems he had suggested this without putting much thought into it. Come on, we can't back down now. People are all excited about it. Our reputation's gonna plummet if we don't face this shit. Ryuji! You're just doing this to be popular and famous! <laughs> I question your actions sometimes! <laughs> that is true. If we remain silent, people would believe we simply chose to run away from the matter. Yusuke? Medjet has, ta has taunted us publicly, after all. If they are criminals, we cannot let them be. If they are. Which sounds like they are. Yeah, and we don't have any other targets right now either. This seems like a really, really reckless idea. Hey Dipper, let's talk to Mishima tomorrow. This is more of... I don't know. No! 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 <laughs> is Mishima part of Medjet? <laughs> Do you want... <laughs> I doubt that. <laughs> also, Makoto, try seeing if your sister has any info on them. I ha it's highly unlikely, but sure. A world class target, huh? <laughs> you have no choice in this. I'm being forced. <laughs> if we can change Medjed's heart, it'll most definitely affect Mementos. Medjed is a bunch of people, right? No. Oh! Wait, no. Sorry, I was thinking for a second that it's the 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 next um the, the the orange haired girl we kept seeing on the computer, but that doesn't work that way. Would be interesting twist to actually go and change a future character's heart and then they join the team. That would be an interesting twist. Actually, I kind of I want to I hope that happens. Crap, that she's hot. First they're sour, and then they're sweet. <laughs> mm. I'm cooking. <laughs> it's what I do. It's handed, my dude. Oh, see, you just got it.
Hmm. Memories. Um. Hmm. Can I not go out anymore? Hey. Dang. I cannot go see the fortune teller. I can cook. Huh? What do you want to do? Mm. Ooh. Next best thing. <sighs> yes. I will have my Becky. <laughs> Alright, I'm really sorry, but I'm off today. No, 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 you're not off today. I'm paying you. <laughs> oh, wait, it's you. I'm off today, but if you just want housekeeping, I don't mind. It still work, so I'll head over after I change. Hang on a bit. Yes, my girl! My girl's here! Becky! Thank you for your continued patronage. Worth it! <laughs> mm, so you just want me to make some curry, right? Yeah. Oh, there it is. My wife first did like the coffee stuff. Now she's in the kitchen cooking me a meal. Oh man, I really want to just give her a back hug right now. It's, she's so close. I'll handle the rest. Why don't you take care of something else? Uh, let me see. What am I close to? Hey. Uh, I'm gonna go think. But isn't she your teacher? For now, but things will change. She just needs to wait until I get older. <laughs> and then, and then we can legally date. <laughs> Okay, knowledge. I'm getting somewhat close. Charm. It's charm in that. Okay. Uh, dang. Alright, so... I guess... I guess I'll go watch a movie. I love you! Hold on, I'm gonna position myself this. Mwah. Okay, bye. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Let's go. You're the most unremarkably attractive woman to ever work fashion, Betsy. God, I love you. Yeah, I hear that. Wait. Curry Kami. What did you say? <laughs> what about your cinema book? Oh, I didn't read. I forgot. <clears throat> oh, that would have been cuter to to be reading while Kawa was making food. Dang. Okay, it looks like this woman's ex lover is rediscovering why he loved her in the first place. Look, it's it's just there's a there's a cute girl, a floor below me. It's a lot of pressure. I I I, I can't. <laughs> I'm I'm nervous, you guys. I'm super nervous. I'm nervous. <laughs> oh. The not so hot Betsy. I have a I have a so hot Becky downstairs. All right, maybe you learn a thing or two about charm. Hmm. Yeah, come on. I'm so close. I'm so close. Okay. Becky? Hi! Hi! Thank you for waiting. Here you go. Decent curry. My future wife can cook! Alright, I'll see you later. 
Ah, oh, to hell with it. I'm just gonna copy Kawa's outfit and just give it to my VTuber. <laughs> what? Tell me. <clears throat> Everyone's been talking about Medjed. What the hell is it? You don't want the news much. Oh, you don't watch the news much. Do you? Do you? There is an, an they're an international network of hacktivists. The target corporations do shady, doing shady business and cause chaos. I like them. The subway's company server thing? That was Medjed, trying to find out who caused the train accident. So, they're good guys? Ugh, no way. Some likened them to digital Robin Hoods. But they... Well? Hold on. My Alexa just went off. What? What? Who are you talking to? Hold on, let me take care of it. <laughs> what? God, the machines are rising. Yeah, Medjed's after me, man. I'm scared. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Medjed's after me. <laughs> I was over here, I was like That was so weird. Like I was like hearing talking in my in my in my place for a second there and I was thinking like did someone break in? Oh my god, how freaky would that be? Someone broke in here. My dog has failed to be the patrol dog. <laughs> <laughs> the timing is so freaky. But they snoop through emails and destroy data. They're no better than criminals. I'm trying to think that I'd say, you know, you know, Exa somewhere. I'm trying to think. Midget, those guys that claim to be modern day Robin Hoods, they did call themselves heroes after those accidents. They're fighting Medjed next. The Phantom Thieves are amazing. Huh. I can't read English. I don't want to hear about justice from some shady hackers. I don't care what happens as long as it's interesting. Hmm. Ooh, our grades are out. Let's go, perfect grade. Damn, I'm dead. Ooh. I wish I can get in the top 10. People look at smart students differently. I wonder what score I got. Top 10? I'm in the top 10! Ooh. My knowledge. Or is it charm? Is it charm? Pull a charm. Points of charm. Hell yeah! I'm gonna be a freaking Casanova. I'm getting there. I feel like I'm halfway through the game by now. I'm more busy. It's not like I can focus on studying. <clears throat> oh god, you're there. <laughs> hey, it's not my fault my scores suck, right? Uh, it's not my fault my scores suck, but you're the one in charge of your own s What? It is your fault. Ah, shit. Do I need to kiss ass so I can earn points from Ryuji? I hate this. Blech. Right? Anyways, there's something more important here. Mishima. No! I didn't get any points from that? Shoot! I just kissed his ass for no reason. Damn it. You want to ask me something about the internet, right? Yep. I'm going to be straight with you here. Do you know who Medjet is? <laughs> you weren't kidding about being direct. Well, I suppose the news about Medjet and the Phantom Thieves has caused quite the commotion. They started out as hackers of justice, but now they only look out for their own self-interests. That's all I know. They were the group I texted him about yesterday. I see. 
Nobody's sure who actually belongs to Medjet. Useless! Well, it looks like things will be exciting this summer. It'll be the Phantom Thieves' world debut, no? Uh... Dude. Same vibe, Ryuji. Yeah. Don't worry. I'll be rooting for the Phantom Thieves. I'll get the forum mobilized as well. Uh... Now, if we're done talking here, I really must be going. I'll see you guys later. So, that was fruitless. I know. Like, every time. <laughs> I'm about halfway through the game. Yeah! Wonder if anyone else got any info. Mishima was pretty useless. Do you guys get anything? <laughs> oh my god, it's funny. I tried asking my sister, but it seemed as though she didn't know very much about them. She doesn't she doesn't specialize in cybercrime after all. I tried looking into them too, but I didn't come up with anything. They are really just no leads. Hmm. Our opponent is truly elusive. No luck. There's like almost no way unless we're like computer geniuses ourselves. Medjet, huh? It seems like we won't be able to deal with them by ourselves. We need help. We need a hacker. I know summer vacation is due to begin next week, but I have an unfortunate announcement. Kawa mama. Nothing unfortunate news with you. <laughs> we'll be holding an emergency assembly on Monday the 25th. Please come to school that day. What? Huh? huh? Settle down. We've had many strange incidents. The psychotic breakdowns, students being dragged into crime rings. <laughs> Hence, Principal Kobayakawa has instructed all teachers to caution the student body. Well, this is inconvenient for us too, you know, <laughs> having to find things to warn you about so suddenly. She funny. How are we gonna find Medjed? I'm not sure. No matter how hard I look online, all I find are just unreliable rumors. They have carried out corporate terrorism, yet they still managed to elude arrest somehow. Kanashiro was a lot of trouble, but this is turning out to be a much greater ordeal. Do we bite off more than we could chew? Uh, if we can't find them, then we need them to find us. So... We need to make some noise. They're too big, I'm not sure. Right, there's no knowing who we're actually up against if we can't see the full picture. We don't even know whether it's a single individual or a large conglomerate of people. And even if we do manage to get a lead, what do we do from there? Damn, this stuff's really not going to go so good. Oof. So, that's probably why my exam's going to shit too. What? You know, those are two separate things, right? Yeah, it really is. Ryuji just trying to find things to blame on except for himself. Damn, this stuff's really not going so good. I'm uncomfy that this person's spying on me. <laughs> Clues on Medjet, huh? So she's not Medjet. I bet she found us found us through the uh, through the phantom site. It's really not hard. Well, I shouldn't say it's really not hard, but thanks to Mishima and him claiming that he knows us, basically just follow Mishima. Follow Mishima, hack his phone, and then you'll see the messages between Mishima and us. 
And boom, you found a Phantom Thieves. At least that's what I think she's doing to find us. If we can't identify who it is, there's nothing we can do. So let's... W <laughs> I can't wait to yell at Mishima again. <laughs> that's what my gut's telling me. Let's wait till they make a move. I can't see any other way of them find us. The student we saw. I've identified the student from the red light district. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. She's a third year. Echo Taco. Taco. I'm thinking of speaking with her directly about this. Can you sit on it? Sit on it too? Ooh, I have Silky with me too. Uh, my god, I haven't been giving any attention to On lately, but I did just get her in the group with Makoto. I do want to do this. Let me grab a DVD first. I need to return my DVD! I'm different finding out it's hard to juggle multiple ladies. <laughs> what do you mean it's hard? Yeah, it's hard. <laughs> they wore me out. They wore me out way too fast. Being a girl in high school and you have a lot of, like, girl, um... I don't want to say girlfriends, but you know what I mean, right? <laughs> They burnt me out. I can't have a lot of like friends that are girls anymore. I just can't. They they mentally have taken a toll on me. I am burnt out. I, I really can't juggle a lot of girls anymore. No, I can't. I I I just can't. I'm make I'm making a limit now. No more than five. <laughs> no more than five. <clears throat> what would you like? Mm. Kindness, proficiency. I guess jailbreak. Get my proficiency up a bit, maybe. I don't know. Kindness. Mm. Oh boy. I guess kindness. We'll work our way down. Okay. Damn dip. You had all the girls fawning over you and I That's not what I meant and you know it. <laughs> but I mean, okay, you actually you may you may not be wrong. Okay, hold on, hold on. I I I I am, again, I am so, I'm so sorry for, if I repeat stories over and over again. But I actually had an incident where one girl had one of my hand and another girl had one of my, had the other hand and literally were yoinking me back and forth saying like, no, she's going with me. Other friends said like, no, she's going with me. So I'm like, yeah, wah, wah, wah. <laughs> I thought that was just a thing that they did in movies and shows and cartoons. I was in shock that it happened in real life. And my arm sleeves got stretched out so bad I had I, I couldn't wear it anymore. That or I had I had to like roll it up. It, it was I, <laughs> Girls are crazy. <laughs> Oh my god. Look, if y'all are just trying to figure out how that happened, it's really simple. It's called letting them just rant and you just be the ear and listen to them and don't say anything back. And then the other one is basically kiss their ass. It's that simple to Riz a lady. <laughs> 
listen or pretend that you're listening and kiss their ass. It's that easy. <laughs> I exaggerate when I say kiss ass, but it's it really is just like, remember how I say I have a difficulty saying no? Yeah, that. Don't say no. <laughs> Don't say no and, and at least bare minimum act like you're listening. And there you have it, you'll be risen a girl no time. <laughs> Take that with a grain of salt. <laughs> uh, they do appreciate when you're just listening. Yeah, it's that's literally it. It just listening goes like gets you so many brownie points. Like they don't they just like want to vent and feel like they're being heard by somebody. I had strangers vent to me because they felt comfortable, and I'm just like, who are you? <laughs> Where was I going again? Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay, you just want to hang out, but... Uh, this girl's got a mission, so let's do it. Makoto, let's go. Okay, thanks. I feel good to hear that you to hear that from you, Dipper. I will call her um, to the council room. Okay, cool. Excuse me. <laughs> See, I'm listening. <laughs> Eka Taco, you've been spending time in the red light district lately, haven't you? With myself and Dipper here, saw you there. I didn't, but I'm just gonna claim that I did because she said so. See, right there. I got bonus points from that. <laughs> Based on where you were heading, we assume you're working at a store called the After School Salon. How is it uh, working there? What do you mean? It's just a normal cafe. They make me wear a costume and stuff, but that's it. Oh, and I don't have to do anything weird, if you know what I mean. It's all totally legal. <sighs> so you're sure nothing strange is going on? Yeah, the worst I get is some weird old guys gawking at me. I see. Beyond that though, why are you working there? I need to have money. How's your financial situation? Uh, fine. I mean, I can just ask my parents for cash whenever I want. Wow. Okay. Then why are you working? Interesting. You just want to have good work ethic? Oh, oh, oh I, I see. But they totally bug me out about why I'm buying if I did that. Oh, okay. That You want privacy to what you're purchasing. Okay. That's why I work at the salon. I guess some people... I get some good spending money, plus the guys who come in there, like, mega pamper me. Hmm. Mega pamper? Are you in some kind of maid cafe? Host club? Me when Dipper says something. Ears, <laughs> all ears. <laughs> Dude, if you guys zone out, zone out. I'm guilty of it, too. <laughs> it's nice having people treat you like you're special, you know? I'm sure a super honor student like you gets that all the time, though. Wow. Did you have to throw that in there? Shady. Anyways, are you gonna tell on me? You even brought a witness today. Hold up. Doesn't that mean you two were in Shinjuku together? What's up with that, Miss Prez? We were on a date. Totally normal. Uh, you have the wrong idea. What if we were together? It's none of your business. Damn. Yeah, you know what? I want to strongly imply. <laughs> I want to strongly imply. So what if we were together, you know? Is that wrong? <laughs> you jealous? It's A. Oh yeah, the point system. Damn it! You have the wrong idea. Ugh. Yes. Yay. 
I keep forgetting about the pawn system existing when they're so good. When the other answer just seems so good. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, well. Right. It was nothing more than an errand I asked him to accompany on me. Company, company me on. At any rate, don't mind him. As for you, I don't plan on telling anyone. Oh, I get it. You're like protecting each other's secrets? Oh crap. And I just realized your boyfriend's that rumored criminal. You're a real badass, Miss Prez. <laughs> that's hot. Well, um... I, I told you that's not how it is. I was just worried you were getting wrapped up in some shady business. So I asked him here for support. Mm, eh, whatever. I don't blame you. He's so hot. <laughs> <laughs> and by the way, I was wondering, is that a Buchimaru's Kun's pencil case? Wait, what? Hmm? Oh, you know Buchimaru? I had like tons of Buchi stuff back when I was a kid. What a blast from the past. Wait, why it's so be up? Well, it was given to me when I was still in elementary school. <laughs> I'd like to buy a new one, but they've stopped selling Buchimaru Kun merchandise. OMG! This is too hilarious! The student council president has an adorable pencil case? <gasps> My image of you has like a complete has done a complete 360 today. Shouldn't it be like 180? Because then if you're doing a 360, you that means you You're right very where you started. <laughs> you just went full circle, right? Um, isn't that a full circle? Oh, hey, Makoto just got it. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just really surprised. You don't really look, uh, you don't really look like the kind of person who'd be into that stuff. I mean, I always thought you were like kind of a robot, like a cold dead fish, but I guess I just had to get to know you better. Hey, why don't we trade phone numbers? I really want to talk to you more about Buchi Maruku and your boyfriend. Cause he's so hot. <laughs> uh, oh, um. Uh, okay. Wait, he's not my boyfriend. Girl, come on. Let me feel a little cool. Hand saved. Oh crap, it's this late already? I've got to get to work. I'll send you tons of pics of my Buchimaru Kun collection though. Bye, bye. <laughs> See ya, girl. Well, that was fun. She was all over the place. Feel that. <laughs> Mood. <laughs> Honestly, though, I'm in shock. She thought I was a robot. <laughs> Don't let it get to you. You can change. Beep boop. Please. Please, Lord have mercy. Let it be beep boop. Let it be beep boop. Please. Please. <laughs> I am begging metaphorically on my knees right now. Is it beep boop? This is a point system one? Why are you giving me such a cool answer option if it's not the right answer? Cursed you, Atlas. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Don't let it get to you. Yay, boring answer. I won't, I'm aware of how one could perceive me that way. Hmm. Beep boop was better. It's funny. You know, I believe Taco said about me is how others think as well. I thought I had a change after the incident with Kanashiro, but perhaps it wasn't enough. You changed in mementos. We're in the real world. That This is completely different, sister. That aside, it was almost inspiring to meet someone so distinct from myself. I'm going to try to look at things a little differently from now on. New perspective, always nice. Well, and well, I think that will help me break out of my shell. 
I hope you're ready. I'm going to show you how useful an honor student can really be. Why are you- why- why- why is this about usefulness? Why is this about usefulness? Just go have fun. I guess that's a quiet resolve from Makoto. Black belt talk? What's this? If negotiating with the martial arts using shadow fails, you can try again. That's very specific. All right. Interesting. I'll be interested to speak with Taco some more now. <sighs> now that I have her contact information, perhaps I can correct her misconception about you. And as always, I'll let you know if anything important happens. Girl, everyone's misconception is going to change. I'm in the top 10. Ciao. <laughs> I'll see you later. Bye bye. Hello, thank you for sitting with, in with me today. I, it really did help. I got a message from Taco earlier. She turned out to be quite a fan of Buchimaru-kun. It was crazy to see a picture of her entire collection. She even has a bunch of Buchimaru-kun emo emoticons. Sounds like you two get along. Uh, okay, calm down. Wow, what to shut down her excitement. Let's encourage. Huh? Yeah, I guess you're right. I didn't expect to bond over something like this though. I'm pretty shocked to be honest. Though, I'm still a little worried about that store she works at. I'll try a little harder to get through to her about about it. I might come to you for more advice later. For now, I'll let you go. Talk to you later. Hmm. Ah, you're back. Not every answer has to be max riz. I mean, once I max riz them, I can just pick whatever answer I want then. Yeah? <laughs> I can go completely chaotic. Once I'm free. Once I'm free from this binds of the, of the affectionate point system. Summer break soon, right? Yeah, it must be nice. So I looked into Medjed. Did you find anything? As you know, Medjed is a god that appears in the Egyptian Book of the Dead. I thought we talked about this already. Uh-huh. Its name apparently means the Smiter. It seems nobody is actually sure that Medjed is a real name. On top of that, almost everything else about him is unknown. Even his form is unattainable. An unseen goal, god that flies through the sky and shoots from his eyes. He truly is an elusive being. Dude. Everything about his existence is shrouded in mystery. Wait. Fundamentally speaking, ancient Egyptian art always depicts gods drawn in uh, a side profile. However, Medjid is facing straight ahead in all depictions of him. Taking all of this into account, he seems to be quite the alien being. I see. I hope that information was at least somewhat useful. Indeed it was. Should I look into it more? That's enough, thank you. So we still don't have any tangible clues. Not at all, all we got was a fun little talk about what Medjet is. Mythology wise. Who's messaging me? <gasps> Becky! Are you kidding me? Why? Why? <laughs> Why? I thought you were a Saturday man. Why are you talking to me on a Tuesday with Kala Mama? This is some bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, Becky. Yay! We can do Becky? Akachi takes priority? Damn it! 
Ignore Ekechi, just go for Becky. <laughs> yeah, we haven't talked to Becky in so long. Let's do it. F Ekechi. <laughs> We're going off the rails. We're going off the rails of the, um, what's, what is it called? Um, of optimizing the best Persona game ever. <laughs> I think that's the word I'm looking for. We're going off the rails. We ain't optimizing. We're doing we're doing greed. Becky! This is Becky. I want to see you, Master. So please request me. How come he's working today? Uh use the yellow phone if you want to call her. Are we not gonna Yeah yes, call her. Let's go make the call then. Okay. Yeah. Oh, uh, let's call the service. Hello, are you perhaps Doghouse? Yeah. Mm. The voice on the phone wasn't Kawakami. Maybe you should ask for more details. Wait, where's my Becky? Uh, who, uh... Who is this? This is the head nurse of Ai Aoyama Hospital speaking on behalf of Kawakami. Becky? Wait! This isn't funny anymore. What's what's happening here? Speaking on the behalf of Kawakami-san, Kawakami actually collapsed and she's been admitted to our hospital. <gasps> My wife! Do you know our hospital's address? Her room number is. <sighs> this isn't good. Let's head over there right away. Oh my god! Oh my god! Jeez. Waifu! Richard Waifu, what happened to you? Do you need me to feed you some soup? I'm just a little overworked. No need to make a big deal out of it. <laughs> nuh uh. No, you need to rest. What can I do for you, my love? But thanks for coming all this way to visit me. Ugh. How could I collapse at a time like this? I really need to make some money. I can give you the money! I can provide! I have the money! How am I supposed to going to- how am I going to make today's payment? I, I hope I have enough payment. What, how much do you need? How much do you need? There you are. Rude man. Oh shit, no. What's going on, Miss Kawa Kawakami? I called the school, but no one answered. What? Takasi-san. You contacted the school? Well, you weren't answering your phone. And when I thought you finally answered, it was a nurse who told us you were here. It's really an inconvenience for us when you miss a payment, you know? She's in a hospital, you ass! I need to take this guy outside and push him down the stairs. Now, now, it's not like she wanted to collapse. Unpleasant woman. Hmm. But our credit card payment is coming up soon, so we'll need you to transfer the money. You're taking advantage of my future wife, you dicks! I'm, I'm sorry. These are Takasi's guardians, the ones I mentioned the other day. They took care of him. They took care of nothing. They're just taking care of themselves. Selfish parasites. Who's this? He's one of my students. He came to visit me. Messing around with another student? Huh? You never learn, do you? Oh, fuck you! And after all you did to him. I'm sorry. So, when are you going to transfer the money? Get off her back! I should be able to send it out tomorrow. Don't strain yourself, don't lie, don't pay them! Is this a point system? Is this a point system? I wanna say don't pay them! Ugh, I feel like don't strain yourself is the next best one too. Do I need to pay them? I'll pay them! I'll pay them to get off your backs, and then I'll murder them. It's C? <gasps> yeah! Let's go! Don't pay them! <gasps> Beautiful! Doghouse Coon. Stay out of this. Oh, push you down the stairs. Don't act so tough, kid. Our precious adoptive son, Taiki, died because of this woman. Honestly, she should have been fired. No, he didn't because of her. Oh, that's not... And yet she still doesn't know her place. 
and she still continues to teach. We're gonna need you to show some remorse for what you did to him. In a material and undeniable way. I understand. I will pay you. So, it's not like we're trying to extort. You are extorting her! You are! But who was it that convinced Taki to start studying when he needed to be working? Ugh. These assholes worked that poor boy. Asking him to work, I bet, to make money for them. Ugh. Just push him down the stairs. The schoolwork on top of his part-time jobs overwhelmed him, which led him to that incident. He shouldn't have been taking a part-time job. It was too much. Why weren't you providing anything for him? Asses. Poor Taki. It's almost like he was murdered. Asses. So you no longer feel regret? In that case, perhaps we should sue the Board of Education. Or should we have a chat with your school? Either, either way, your days as a teacher would be over. Please let me say, please let me go to Mementos. Let me go to Mementos. I can, I want to knock a screw loose out of them. Well, we're looking forward to receiving your payment. <sighs> I have to figure out a way to make more money. You need to get a way to, you need a way to get out of them. I guess transferring to our sister company is the only way. Sister company? Can you make a lot there? Think this through more. Uh, it's either A or maybe C. Which one? The answer is C. Nice. Nice! <laughs> I can't believe I'm getting scolded by my student. Why? Why are you so interested in helping me? I love you. I mean, what? I'm not worth it. You're totally worth it. I mean, what? <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna stop worrying about it. Hell yeah! The money? I'll pay it. I'll do everything Master tells me to do. Huh? Are we role-playing right now? Meow. That's not a happy face. I'm so tired. All I really want is a way to apologize to Takasi-kun. So if his guardians demand money, then I just have to pay them. No. That's the wrong choice. Isn't there another way? Just rest for now. Is it C again? It's definitely the wrong choice, though. I just don't know if it's the right time to talk about it. Is it A or C? It's... A. Oh, cue the music. It's C. It's A. It's A and C. I don't think it even matters. And the answer works. Okay, cool. Mm. You know what? Rest for now. Just rest for now. But then again, maybe we should have this talk now. It's the wrong choice. But then rest for now. I'm so torn. I'm so torn. <sighs> Just rest for now. Let's talk about this when you're done resting, please. Sorry, I'm not quite back to 100% yet. So my thoughts are all over the place. Yeah, no, you're stressing. Rest for now and then calm yourself. Calm yourself. I'm going to get some rest. I'm glad you're listening. I appreciate you coming to visit me today. It made me really happy. It made me happy. Even though the, the events of who visited you made me very unhappy. Making me think a lot of violent thoughts. <laughs> I feel like Kawakami is starting to depend on me. Yes. We are ranking up. Oh my god, look at those pretty stars. All right. No, don't cough. I'll be released first thing tomorrow morning, so don't worry. The IVs here work really well. 
Visiting hours are over. No! I'll see you later then. Waifu! Get home safe, okay? Tragic. Am I gonna dream about Kawa? <laughs> I need names. Well, Seems damn. You've got your share of problems, inmate. Ah, I was hoping I was going to have another conversation with her. I didn't think it was going to end so soon. Dang it. Opportunity missed. To think you would relax under such circumstances. Either you're quite bold or quite foolish. Let's go with foolish. One with an unseen form. Hmm. Hmm? It seems you've been targeted by troublesome company. I'm always targeted. What's new? <laughs> you mean Medjed? <laughs> I've been enjoying this endless dispute over justice. However, it will soon come to an end, and through the appearance of an unexpected force of all things. Engaging with formidable enemies is also part of your rehabilitation. I ask that you overcome this. After all, you must hone your powers and become a magnificent thief. I'm trying. It's really summer now. I get sweaty just walking a little bit. I didn't think Medjed would pounce on the Phantom Thieves. Interesting things keep happening this year. Well, how, how do we keep bumping it? Ha, hold on. We keep bumping into each other here. This is a very public area. Are we timing this? Are, are we scheduling our meetings or what? The influence of the Phantom Thieves knows no bounds. I underestimated it. Honestly. The influence of the chaos crew lows no bounds. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> I wonder what the public thinks of this. Are they entertained? Or perhaps inconvenienced? Why would they see us as inconvenienced? Oh, maybe they're in the middle of hacking something to do their own re reveal and we and we took the credit instead. I bet it's because credit. I bet I bet we we snuffed out their credit, their moment, their shining moment. Kind of like with the uh, say uh, Makoto's sister. People with common sense would think that. Is that your personal opinion too? I, yeah. Still. The vast majority are simply entertained by it. They've stopped thinking critically altogether. Oh, wait. Maybe I misunderstood what he was asking. So this is what the public thinks. Oops. I don't have time for a conversation. My attendance has been poor due to interviews lately. Humble brag? Thank you for your valuable opinion. I'll see you around. <laughs> Just not on call one night, Akechi. That's all I ask. Contact me Monday. Contact me Wednesday. Just not when Kawa contact me. I don't me. get it. There hasn't been any news on the Phantom Thieves versus Medjet showdown. Which of them will come out on top? They're both just criminals pretending to be heroes. If you ask me, Medjet causes way more trouble. They attack every company that set their sights on. I see. Well, I just hope something happens soon. But you gotta tell me. Who do you think will win? Well, I wanna hear the answer, and then gloat about it later. Hey, your phone was buzzing earlier. Whoa. Nice. I've gotten a lot of messages from an unknown account. Uh 
Nice to meet you. I am the one they call Alibaba. Or Alibaba. <laughs> Ali. <laughs> I want to ask you something. You're a phantom thief, aren't you? Mishima! <laughs> it's finally happening! Can you really steal hearts? Who is this? Why does he know that you're a phantom thief? It's Mishima's fault. Is one of our teammates pulling a prank on you? No. There is someone whose heart I would like you to steal. But I'm not asking for charity. Let's make a deal. You wish to know about Medjed, correct? Ooh. I can give you information on them if you can change if if the change of heart is successful. If you so desire, I can take care of them as well. Oh, it's our hacker. It's our girl, tech girl. Let's go. Do you believe in my skills? I got nothing else to go on. I can track down their accounts just as I have with yours. But this is all I can prove at the moment. I prepared the necessary tool on my end. Look forward to it. Shouldn't you respond to it? How should I respond? Uh, okay, sounds good. Who is this? You've got the wrong guy. This is a prank. Oh, where's my, uh, this is a good idea option? <laughs> Why don't I have that option? Damn it. <laughs> uh, who is this? You got the wrong guy. Is this a prank? Uh, who this? I won't tell. Uh... I won't get anything interesting. Oh, you got the wrong guy. Actually, that would be kind of funny. <laughs> you got the wrong guy. I can't find the account. Oh, nothing. Ah, that's even worse. No response whatsoever. I can't find the account to send a respond to. All I get back is an error message. Ooh. Smart. You can't reply back? Nope. I don't know what this is all about, but we should probably let everyone know about this. That we've got something of a clue so we can get to Medjed? Yeah. I wonder whose heart she wants, she wants to steal. I'm pretty sure it's the hacker girl. It has to be. Interesting. Medjed, what is happening to this country? It'd be hilarious if the honor student fell off the podium. You're a Bish. Is it over for the Phantom Thieves? Hacking? I have no idea what that's like, but it sounds scary. Beep boop. I think they were getting a little cocky. They got what was coming to them. Considering he mentioned stealing hearts, he knows, doesn't he? Seems so. How were we found out? Fandom site? He may have traced our chat log. How careless of us. But how would he have known all these details with just that? Do you think that there is another cause? Yeah. I'm not sure why, but that's the feeling I get. Hey, is it that easy to look at someone else's chat log? I don't know much about it myself, but it's probably not impossible, I think. How's it done? Maybe they extracted our phone's data? I mean, the phones now are pretty much computers. Why is he getting an error when he tries to reply? They destroyed it. Or... Perhaps the receiving end doesn't exist. Disposable phones. That's possible? Don't ask me everything. I told you that I don't know much about it. Whoa, okay, woo, Makoto. Don't stress, calm down. Wait, might this be what is referred to as hacking? Yes. Then 
Does that mean this guy's a hacker? Y yes. I don't get high tech stuff. What does this all mean? An unknown hacker contacted us. I see. I don't really get it. Then, is this person measured? <laughs> I doubt uh. it. Considering he says he wants to deal with them. That is, only if we take his words for face value. True. Hey, wouldn't it be great if we got this guy on our side? But we know nothing about his identity at all. We can't trust him. I don't think it's a bad deal, though. Even if Alibaba turns out to be a criminal, I am not helping anyone of that sort. Oh, right. That wouldn't be good. The I've prepared the necessary tool part makes no sense either. Could this just be a prank? He knows an awful lot for it to be a prank. If he knows who we are, won't we get caught? No, if he wanted to report us, I think he would have done it already. He must have some sort of objective of his own. He did offer us a deal after all. I'm certain he'll contact us again. Yep. There's no telling when he'll do so, though. It'd be best if we stay together. If something happens, we can act at once. I'm fine, except on Fridays and Saturdays. No particular reason. <laughs> yeah. So, somewhere we can wait and hide for long hours. Mm, so my place? How about LeBlanc? Good answer. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> What's with the big group? Good evening. We were thinking about putting together plans for our summer. Hmm. Is that a new face I see? My god. <laughs> His tone is so different when he's talking to An. It's nice to meet you. My name is Makoto Nijima. I hope we're not being a bother. She's our student council president. Nijima. Is something wrong? <laughs> Your sister's been here. No, it's nothing. A student council president, eh? <laughs> I'm stunned. I hope he's not causing you too much trouble. I'm Sojiro Sakura, but everyone just called me boss. Or dad. By the way, that was addressed to you. Oh. Uh, this old man will get going and leave you kids be. Cool. All right. The store is all yours. Thanks, Dad. I mean, boss. <laughs> we have late breaking news on Medjit, whose notoriety rose since their statement the other day. Just moments ago, a new message has been released on their website. They have announced their victory over the Phantom Thieves. Huh? How so? Medjit also warns any Japanese citizens who praised the Phantom Thieves to stop doing so. Wow, not cool. We will report any further actions by Medjit as they arrive. Oh, come on. It's in English. Let me see. The Phantom Thieves remain silent at our question. This proves that we are just. No. It doesn't. Wow. This is crazy talk. People of Japan, wake up. You must not worship the Phantom Thieves. What? That's bullshit! Oops. Keep listening. We will discipline any who worship them. The punishment is the confiscation of possessions. Hmm. We are Medjed. We are unseen. We will eliminate evil. Except ourselves. We tyrants who want to control everything. Yeesh. That's what it says. Wow. Unbelievable way of thinking. What does that all mean? It means they're crazy. 
They're saying that they'll target sympathizers of the Phantom Thieves. Confiscation of possessions, hmm? Perhaps bank accounts or personal information? Either way, it won't be anything pleasant. Why the hell are we being singled out? Perhaps all they care about is labeling the Phantom Thieves as crooks. That all this wouldn't have happened had the Phantom Thieves not existed. It's the government. That's complete bullshit! Talk about a troublesome organization that we've been targeted by. Isn't there anything we can do? It certainly can't do anything about this on our own. Hey, so what's this letter about? No need any more trouble. It's rare for you to get something like this. Oh? A calling card. Oh no. Anything else in there? Oh no. But we're not crooked enough to have our own palace. Who's this from, anyway? There's no stamp on it. Someone must have directly dropped it into the mailbox here. Another phantom thief. Could it have been Alibaba? Cool. That reminds me. He did mention something about preparing the necessary tool. Hmm. Don't tell me. Is this what he was talking about? What the hell's going on here? All we can do at the moment is wait for Alibaba's orders. Let's brace ourselves and stand by. In case anything comes up. Oh dear. Was that Takoyaki? I think I just saw Taku Takoyaki. I really started turning the heat up on the forum. I put a special post up and everything. Oh dear. Mishima, you're gonna get targeted. The showdown between the Just Phantom Thieves and the global organization Medjet is here. Reactions have been great too. Everyone is really engaged. Until something happens, I bet. So far, most of the comments have been pro Phantom Thieves. Most likely because of what happened in the Kanashira case. Those on the other side say Medjet are hackers of justice. The way they talk though is completely tyrannical though. Why are they following them? <laughs> But there's nothing resembling justice in what they do. Someday I want the whole site to be filled with pro thieves comments. I'm looking forward to when that day finally arrives. It will never arrive, Mishima. That is that is definitely a pipe dream. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. There will always be people who will oppose you. Even if you are correct, they will just oppose you just because of their ego. Or some drama fit that they don't have. Because pe some people are just, you know, function differently. He can look forward to whatever he wants. We have no means of striking back against Medjet. We're going to be in deep trouble if we don't do something. Mm. Sounds like Mishima needs today's sponsor, NordVPN. <laughs> oh my god. First Alibaba character, and now a blank calling card. What the hell is going on? Weird things are happening. Oh, my friends are gone. I is sad. How are we doing over here? Hey. Are we getting close charm? No idea for knowledge. I'm close somewhat. Again, somewhat. Dang it. What do I have for books? Hey! Oh, wait, the fortune teller! I totally forgot. Wait, can I leave? Hey! Dang it! I'm trying, you guys. I'm really trying, but the game won't let me. <laughs> Akichi time? Wait, I can go see him? Uh. Let me. 
I can't go anywhere. Hey. There's nothing inside. Battle science. Anything? Anything to be more charming? Damn it. Nothing for charming. Ugh. Damn it. Gosh. <sighs> well. May we check? Check what? To get out? I can't. Read the cinema book so you can get more points for watching. Ooh! That sounds good. Hey! Uh, the Craft of Cinema. Comprehensive guide on increasing emotional depth on on the camera for film buffs. Hell yeah. Yeah, you guys are right. Thank you. Oh, wait, but I could be doing that in a train. Damn it. I could be watching a movie now here and then do the reading on a train. Although that hasn't happened in a while. Yeah. Okay. Womp womp. Oh. All right. <sighs> nice. Hot spot stuff to unlock new areas. Ooh. I wonder why I haven't read anything on a on a train lately. It's been a while. Why haven't the Phantom Thief said anything? Having your money stolen sounds terrifying. It's unsettling not knowing what they're going to do to us. They're declaring their victory. What does that mean? I really wish they stopped that. Problem. Good morning. Hello. <sighs> Every day is so hot. I empty my water bottle so fast. By the way, summer break is coming up. Could I ask what your plans are? I got nothing. <laughs> That's a lame answer. What about you? Una reverse. So anyway. You can't really hang out with when MSQ is happening. Wah, wah. I'll be mostly doing training with the gymnastics team and I have free time. I'll be doing self training, of course. I would like you to join me, Senpai, whenever you're available. Oh, okay. Oh, the train is here. Gotta go. Alright, alright. I'm back at school hey, again. Your phone's buzzing. Oh no. Did Alibaba message you? Mm, no. It's just Ryuji. I know, I know, I know, Morgana. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing? Let us know ASAP if he tries to get in touch with you, okay? Ryuji again? Oh. He just never shuts up, does he? Nope. <laughs> oh, shit! Good day. Who is this? What do you want? Good day to you, too. <laughs> ah, you respond today. You didn't give me a chance to respond last time. Once again, I am Alibaba. <laughs> you are the leader of the Phantom Thieves, correct? Yeah? <laughs> you know, whatever. Let's go for it. Yeah, that's right. Mm, I appreciate your honesty. I take it you received the calling card? So it really was from this guy. Yee. Yeah. Are you at school right now? I'm in class. Mm, you're a surprisingly diligent student. 
Yeah, I'm a good boy. Now then, I have prepared the calling card for you. When are you going to steal it? Steal what? What was on the calling card? I'm sorry, did we read that thing? I don't remember reading that thing. What are you talking about? Steal from who? Who are you again? <laughs> Uh, stealing a heart, of course. Aren't you able to steal a heart as long as you have a calling card? Oh, that's cute. They think that's how it works. Tell him. We need the name of the target. <laughs> What's the target's name? I need a name. A name? Is your heart thievery truly impossible without such information? Yeah? <laughs> it is. I see. Um, I suppose past calling cards did have names on them. One moment. Very well, I'll tell you. Uh, I believe their name was Futaba Sakura. Wait, then who the hell are you? Huh? 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 Uh oh. Wait, now I don't want to be nice. Who are you? No, I'm comfy. What? If you fail in this mission, I'll expose your identity to the world and to the police. Well, then I'll be counting on you. We shall speak again after the change of heart. Who are you? Wait, hold on. Who, who are you? Ah, damn it. Can't find the account to send the response to. All I get back is an error message. Dick! So he threatened you, then just took off? Yeah! Rude, right? Sakura? I feel like I've heard that name before. In any case, we should let everyone know about this. I'm so confused. Oh no! I'm in danger! We're gonna get reported if we don't do this? What the hell? I don't... Wait, what? Futaba Sakura? Wasn't Sakura? It's boss's last name! Wait, what? Does he have any family? <gasps> I feel so stupid! Does he? Does he? Reels? How laid back are you? Pretty damn laid back, Ryuji. You have no idea. <laughs> Wait, like you should talk. Wouldn't you normally be introduced at least? I mean, you are living at his place. Look, the bare minimum is not to bother the guy, Ryuji. You you don't understand. Dad has his privacies, and he definitely doesn't want me included. The best I got is coffee and curry. <laughs> That was the most I can get him to share with me. Well, his situation does make things difficult. This situation makes things... I don't know. It just turned my world upside down right now. What is happening? The calling card was delivered to Boss's house. It'd be more natural to assume this is all related. Oh... One of the reasons for that is because Alibaba mentioned nothing about which Futaba Sakura. Perhaps he thinks that the name alone is enough. That makes sense. Huh. I believe it's adequate for us to think that this is the doing of someone close by. I see. I don't know how Alibaba got a hold of his smartphone information. Uh -huh. However, since he's ordering us through chat, I do feel as though he's taunting us. You mean this might just be a prank? I mean an adult. I mean, look at his demands. Pay me if you don't want me to leak who you really are. That I'd understand. But he's telling us to steal someone's heart without explaining why. So we're being tested. We're getting blackmailed. Regardless, I think we should ask boss about Futaba Sakura once. 
That's probably for the best. There's nothing else we can do at the moment, and Chief might have an idea on what this is about, too. I'll check the school's roster just in case. Oh, I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't want to poke the bear. I don't want to. I just got on boss's good side. He may not want me as a son anymore. I think this is a big... I don't know. <laughs> oh, no. We must make sure boss doesn't figure out who we are. We'll have to go about this cautiously. This is... No. I don't like this. I don't like this. <laughs> I need to think of another place to stay. I don't think I'm going to have a home anymore. Oh no! Hey, Dad. What's up? <laughs> I don't like this. Ooh. Hi. Who's Futaba Sakura? I want to meet Futaba. This is all too much already. Can I? Ah. Uh... Hold on, this one seems a little bit more gentle. This one seems a little too aggressive. Who's Futaba Sakura? Why do you know about that? I, 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 I have no... I did not think of this question. <laughs> I, I don't have a response. I don't know. Hmm. Please don't be mad. It's got nothing to do with you. Uh... I'm going home. Make sure you lock up the place. Oh god, he's mad. He's mad. He's on high alert. Looks like it's a hit. I don't want you to be mad at me. <laughs> All I seek is approval. <laughs> This is bad. Oh, I just remembered. Dipper, were you able to ask the boss about Futaba Sakura? I asked, but I certainly did not get anything good from it. He didn't want to talk. Could there be a reason as to why that is? Hmm, Alibaba might be our only hope of defeating Medjed. I wish we could get some info about Futaba out of boss. No, there's gotta be another way. But trying to force it out would probably have the opposite effect. To be honest, I owe a great deal to both Boss and Dipper. Yeah, yeah. leave me and Yusuke out. You all do what you need to do. He can be mad at you guys, but not at me. I don't wish, I don't wish to be, uh, I don't wish for this to be a source of discord between them. Yeah, I know what you mean. It's probably best to wait for Boss to bring the subject up himself. He's gonna interrogate me! I'm scared! I don't think I'll see the next day! <laughs> nice. Oh! Is there a crossword puzzle I can play around with? Calm my nerves. There's nothing here to calm my nerves. Damn. And I can't leave either, can I? Hey! Nope, okay. It's probably when it's palace time I can do what I need to do. I guess I'll go watch a movie. Oh! I don't know, man. This man is a convicted criminal, yet you want to save him? His guilt or innocence is for the courts to decide. My only concern is that he lives long enough to get there. A story about daily struggles of doctors working in an emergency ward. Wow! I'm watching that drama. I like this guy. A person's life is valuable, no matter what they've done. Yep. No matter the circumstances, those doctors never gave up. Maybe you'll learn a thing or two about kindness. Mm -hmm. I'm super kind. Well, it's starting to get late. Let's head to bed soon. I need more Riz.
Oh, you could have Kawakami make lockpicks for Yo. you. Dang, you're right. Whoops. It's the ER. The plot thickens. It really did! Tomorrow's the end of the first semester, but ugh, we still got all this lame shit coming up. Eh. If you don't take care of this lame shit, you can kiss your summer vacation goodbye. Oh yeah, about this Futaba Sakura girl. If she's related to Boss, think people living nearby would know about her? Ryuji, I'm scared. <laughs> get involved with with my dad's I don't know is this a, is this a daughter oh god that's some oh keen god. intuition coming from you Ryuji you should have made use of that on your exams I can't I I I that's probably one line I will not cross if that is actually the daughter of boss I'm not risen her no no, <laughs> this seems this seems very dangerous. Oh, I never want to think about exams ever again. I'm gonna get shot. <laughs> anyway, asking around in your neighborhood might be the fastest way to figure this shit out. And again, I doubt it'll be that easy. It never is. I'd rather deal with Kamashita was again. <laughs> <laughs> Vacation starts the day after tomorrow, don't forget. There's an urgent assembly on Monday. We'll be taking attendance. Boo. There's been an unusual number of strange incidents this year. But don't do anything stupid over break. No promises. Got it? Don't go someplace shady like the red light district. <laughs> and don't go to the beach after dark. I wanna go to the beach. I wanna go to the beach! I wanna jump in some cold water. <sighs> mm, time to be studious. Seems like we won't be having fun in our summer break for a while. Unfortunate. Mm. Ryuji might be right. We don't have a single clue. Might as well try. We've got nothing to lose. You don't! I'm about to lose my life. Let's head to Yongin and gather info around the neighborhood. I hate all of you right now. <laughs> Futaba. Futaba, yes, I know that name. Heard it before somewhere. Ah, uh, yes, that was the name of the teacher I had a crush on back when I was in elementary school. Uh... Okay, no. A uh, poof. That was not right. Okay, let's see what we got over here. Woo! Ah! I never thank you so much for the tip. Thank you, thank you. But Dipper, if it's true, then rizzing her will make Sojiro your day for real. Oh. No, wait, 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 wait. You're gonna get me killed! <laughs> Sucker is single, right? <laughs> I thought he didn't have any children. <coughs> Alright, so you know nothing. Oh my gosh. You? Utaba? No, I don't know who that could be. <laughs> Once I get Persona 5 on my birthday, I'm risen Futaba. <laughs> You're a bold gamer. <laughs> You're a bold gamer. Futaba, who knows? The donation is right. Yeah, but I'm not wrong either. I'm gonna get shot. <laughs> <laughs> I don't- I'm- I'm reading- I'm reading my dad's, like, protective skill. I think he's- he's gonna have it- he's gonna pull out that shotgun and be like, What are you doing? <laughs> By the way, did you- do you eat a lot? Uh... Wait, what? Uh, hey, I'm a grown boy. If it's just you and him, then you've been eating enough for two, right? 
You must have quite the appetite. But you're telling me that you don't you don't actually eat that much? Maybe it's boss who eats a lot then. Why are we talking about this? You're weird. <laughs> Ooh, you look like you've been around for a while. Wise old man, can you tell me about Futaba? Futaba? Who's that? I don't think I know anybody that name. Failure! Hmm, but wouldn't this Futaba get angry if they find out that you're snooping on them? Hmm, who are you? Futaba? Nope, don't know anyone like that. I come to deliver sucker as often. Come to Sucker as often to make deliveries, but I've never seen who you're talking about. So, up until now, our biggest lead seems to be nothing. The chief buys a lot of food, far more than enough for one person living alone. Oh, oh, the details. Yeah, okay. I, you know what? I didn't think about that. Let's check out all the shops where you can buy food. Okay, hold on. Okay, shops, 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 shops. Uh, to the grocery store. I can detect it. This place is close to LeBlanc, so we might be able to learn something here. I'm gonna be de I'm gonna be the best detective there is. <laughs> hey there, welcome. Hmm, Futaba? Over at Sakura-san's? I haven't heard anything. Uh, sorry. Come again. Hmm. We didn't find anything on Futaba. Please tell me the worst case scenario is not me trying to stalk my own dad to see where he goes at night, because I'm gonna hate it. I think our only option now is to go home and ask the chief directly. I hate that option too. This is bad. <sighs> you read the letter, did you not? I'm just saying, I'm gonna carry the Sakura legacy. <laughs> oh my god! Damn! Bold. Oh, hey, you're here. So you're the one who tipped him off about Futaba. What? You really shouldn't have done that. I have no intention of talking to you about Wakaba. Tipped off? What are you talking about? Uh-oh. I should quickly just slowly back away and turn around. Back to the matter at hand. Your parental authority will have to be suspended. I take it you're okay with that outcome? Oh, shoot. Is she like a divorce a divorce lawyer or something? What? Considering the state of your daughter and your family overall, there are no points in your favor. Uh-oh. Would you like to take this to domestic court? Our chances of victory are roughly 99.9% .9 though. Our chances of victory? You're his lawyer? With these suspicions of abuse, there's no way you could avoid having your custody revoked. No, 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 you can't be his lawyer. You're going that far? I told you I don't know a damn thing about it. Ah. Uh... We're extremely serious about this. Ugh. As long as there's a possibility that cognitive science can be linked to psychotic breakdowns. Wh what is going on? Why is my dad involved in this? Fine. You win. Huh? Thank you. I will contact you at a later date. I doubt you'll find anything you want to hear, though. That's fine. It will be up to us to decide whether the information you give us is useful or not. Next time I come here, it will just be for a nice cup of coffee. And stay out! That woman is real good at pissing people off! Dad, I'm scared! You're getting really angry! What's with that look? You got something to say? I... I'm... I... Um... I... Oh... Please... Look into the pools of my eyes! This, these puppy dog eyes! Please answer my question! 
Who's your daughter? Okay, maybe not that. Hold on, what was that? Court? Custody? Uh... So, custody? Yeah, what's that about? The answer is always a... This doesn't involve you. Please? Is Futaba your daughter? I know. That's enough. Just behave yourself. And keep going to school if you don't want me to throw you out of here. But I'm too cute to throw out. You got that? <gasps> Lock the store up. Well, that basically confirms Futaba exists at least. But it sounds like she's got her own problems. More so, our conjecture that Alibaba is connected to LeBlanc seems to have a pretty solid foundation. Oh, and didn't they mention cognitive something? I wonder what the chief's hiding. We can't really press him on the subject, though, especially after he mentioned throwing you out. I'm scared. Oh, gee, what lookers, you guys? Dad's mad. Ooh. Yeah, yo, how'd it go? Don't make me do this again. You ask him. You found out anything about Futaba Sakura? She exists. I've been wondering about that, too. Uh, I'll tell you tomorrow. Whoa, so you did learn something. Fine work. I knew we can count on you. I hate this. Dipper, thank you. Um, all right, let's all meet up tomorrow. Yeah, shady moat, shady moat. Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I guess we're gonna find out about something. Oh. Oh. Uh, uh, I got nothing here to make my charm go up. Let's see. What do you want to do? Uh, I need to make. I need to raise my proficiency. Okay. It, it's whatever. Just raise my proficiency, please. Yeah. Uh, I'll make it alone because I don't think I'm gonna get proficiency if I call Kawakami. <laughs> Wait. Where's my proficiency bone? Do I not get the. Wait, what? Ugh. That's too many. Zero left. Huh? Oh, Dipper, wait. Have Kawa make the lockpicks and watch the rest of the DVD, but I won't get my proficiency if I make her do the lockpicking. There might be a video game console to sell in the same store you bought your DVD, huh? Can you make more than three? I think so. I mean, I, I can make five. You'll get it after when you finish crafting. Oh, okay, cool. You only get proficiency when you're done making them. Okay. Yeah. I guess. Wait, wait, wait. If I do them all now, then I won't be able to do. For, I won't be able to do grow my proficiency this way anymore at night. Right? Does- Do I get more profici proficiency points depending on how much I make? Playing video games rise stats as well. What- I have video games? 
What's up? So do one instead. That's five more for tonight. Otherwise you are just quitting early. Don't stop. Wait, I, I'm trying to figure out what you guys are talking about. What does lockpick have to do about have to do about with the video game thing? You can leave the cafe to get the gaming system. Oh. So then just leave then. Oh, okay. I was getting confused. <laughs> you can do up to seven because you're proficient. Yeah, I know, but if I do too much of it, I won't have enough materials to do more block picks, right? Ah, uh, whatever, fine. Yeah. There you go. Yes. You're definitely getting better. I can tell just by watching yeah. you. Oh, there it is. Nice. There we go. Well then. Wait, it's Friday. <gasps> no! A woman was threatening boss. I didn't call Kawa. I I totally lost track of the day. Oh no. <laughs> I forgot. I didn't realize it was Friday. You know the gun caller? Oh, okay. She was going on about domestic abuse and taking the case to court and stuff. What's up? It's nothing. It's a sister. So to summarize what you told us, Futaba is boss's daughter, and he's abusing her? I don't think that's... Wait, where did we think that? Hold on. I don't know him very well. Is he really the kind of person who would do that? I think we got some false accusations here going on. What's happening here? There's no way. I would like to believe so as well, but we don't have any conclusive evidence, do we? Is it Alibaba? I don't believe say. I don't believe say. I don't believe it. There's no way dad did that. I've given you a calling card and told you the target's name. You should be ready for this. Why aren't you doing it? I told you I'd help if you stole her heart. What seems to be the, ho the hold up? I also said I'd report your identity to the police if you didn't help me. Are you okay with that? I'm serious here. A selfish person. Yeah, this person's being a prick right now. What's going on? Well, he does have information on us. Why the rush? Anyways, this Futaba he's talking about have a palace? If so, we need keywords to get in. I wish we had like a reason why they want to want her heart stolen. Try messaging him about him. Does she have a palace? Tell me her key words. What does that even mean? <laughs> Will you understand? What are we supposed to do about this? We'd be able to figure out Alibaba's identity if we could just meet with him. 
Try asking him if there's any way we could meet up. Hmm. I want to meet you. That'll be difficult. I have reasons for not being able to go out. And that's why I'm contacting you like this. He can't go out? Are they under house arrest? Wait, I get it. You steal people's hearts directly. That might make things difficult. Extremely difficult. One moment. I'm thinking. Okay, it's a shame, but I'm calling this deal off. Stop looking into Futaba Sakura. What? What is happening? Forget this ever happened. I won't report you to the police either. Don't worry. Sorry for taking your time. Now, if you'll excuse me. Uh, who are you? I said the deal's off. We're never going to speak again. Don't expect me to contact you anymore either. Uh, we're not done here. Why are you doing this? Damn it. He just shut the whole operation down? What the hell just happened? This doesn't make any sense. I know! Not only can Alibaba not go out, but he won't let us meet Futaba either. Well, it's none of our business now. We can't contact him anymore. But what do we do about Medjed? We won't be able to get Alibaba to help us with them now. make sense of it. I'm trying to make sense of it, but I can't make sense of it. Is the person who, who, who's who been texting me Futaba? It sounds like they... No, that doesn't make any sense, though. The whole moment about like let's meet definitely made things weird like we can't do anything unless we do the meeting like that wasn't an issue but it may sound like if we ah anyways <laughs> maybe they were just pranking us it's odd they made that huge declaration but they ain't done nothing since <laughs> I bet we got them freaked out you mean they backed out because they're afraid we'll change their hearts? Hmm. Yep. And now it'd just make them look lame if they came out and apologized. But... I guess with Alibaba and Medjid out of the picture, can we just say this case is closed? Is Medjid out of the picture? <sighs> you do have a point. Hmm. I guess it is safe for us to relax a little. Oh yeah, remember Kaneshiro's treasure? Prepare to have your minds blown. Did you sell it? Cooking time? Not really. I'm I'm out of I just I can't. I hmm. Hold on one second. I'm just going to pop in a little bit of chocolate. <laughs> mm, fancy. I love this. Dude, whoever got me the chocolate throne gift, thank you so much. <laughs> it's been very enjoyable. <laughs> we got 150,000 yen out of it. Holy cannoli, yo. Can I have it so I can give it to my future waifu? She needs money. We can really go all out with that kind of money. No, my waifu needs it. Yeah, let's make up for what happened at the fireworks festival. No! We gotta go eat something fitting for the Phantom Thieves' worldwide debut. Can I invite Kawa? <laughs> Where would be good? Hmm. Ooh, 
Ooh, how about sushi? I could really go for some eel too. I like sushi. Yeah, let's go. How soon she forgets. The best is to fill yourself on ginger before beginning to eat sushi. What? That is my master technique. You don't need to do that this time. Actually, definitely don't do it. Okay. <laughs> I'm all for sushi. You're okay with that too, right? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Sushi's fine. I love sushi. Then it's decided. All right. We'll go tomorrow night. I get them at the grocery store when they're on days off. So the sushi is like $5. Rather than your traditional, like, $8 or whatever. They overprice it everywhere else. I feel like to get sushi at the lowest, go to a grocery store. I wonder if this is, um, if all that Medjed business was just a prank. What's really nice, too, about going to the grocery store, and I'm not talking about, like, giants or anything. I'm talking about going to an international market. You get thick cuts of the meat because I was super mad that I paid like X amount of money for sushi at a restaurant for a tiny piece of uh, salmon 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 it was so tiny I'm never gonna order anywhere else again I swear I go to this one place that's near me and it's the cuts thick Now that I think about it calmly, it's strange that they haven't actually done anything. If their goal is to target the Phantom Thieves, they should want to be acting now, given our, given our frame. Fame! Sushi is one of my favorite foods. Hell yeah! Huh, when you put it that way, it kind of makes me wonder too. Especially after they taunted us theatrically like that. Yes, however, it would be best for us to come up with a countermeasure regardless. For now, though, we should cautiously enjoy the sushi. That is all we can do. Cautiously enjoy. <laughs> yeah, but something's not right. My dad's mad at me. Can we get him sushi? I want to bring home sushi for him. I was thinking that, too. I can't really put it into words, though. Yusuke is right. Oh, I'm sorry for bringing this up. On the day before our celebration party, too. Cheer up, Makoto. We'll be eating sushi like kings tomorrow. I hope one person in particular is on their best behavior. I'll refrain from saying who, though. You better not be talking about me. <laughs> Hole in the wall local shops are my favorite. Hell yeah. Better than those chains. Yeah, for sure. I feel like most chain places give you like a fingernail of sushi, <laughs> or at least the uh, like the cuts of the of the raw fish. It's like a fingernail. <clears throat> All right, let's go. No going out. I can't go out again. But it's Saturday. I can have Kawa over. I think. Hey. We have tomorrow to think about. Let's call Kawa Kama another night. Damn it, Morgana! <sighs> I think I'm done with my DVD. No, I'm not done. All right, I see you. I'll do it. If you try to save both the mother and the baby, you'll lose them both. Or I could save them both. I can do this. You need to trust me. It didn't show my funny message. Shoot, I need to go back and look at it again. <laughs> my brain. <laughs> My brain had a memory wipe. <laughs> Thank you so much. 
much. Thank you so much. Let me go. Let me go look at it. Unless I missed it. I'll I'll, ch I'll check on it after the stream. Thank you so much. Yeah. Now I got like literally like a like bottles of like chocolate bottles full of liquor, and then I got like truffle a truffle box full of liquor. <laughs> I, I didn't think... <laughs> but thoroughly enjoying them. <laughs> Thank you. That's incredible. Oh. Mm -hmm. Look at all those points. Okay. So many points. No, Kawa. You seem quite busy, Sai-san. Oh. I take it you're stuck in the middle of everything. Somehow we all just seem to be familiar and, and stuck in some kind of inner circle with each other. The Phantom Thieves made a mockery of us when they brought down Kanashiro. Yeah, the book really did help. Thank you for that. Thank you for letting me know about it. <laughs> To make matters worse, Medjid, who has been dormant for some time now, just declared war on them. How much more can they screw us over? We're not trying to! You're acting like the victim, jeez. You're just mad because things are not going your way. Stress is bad for the skin, you know. Truth. Did you come all this way simply to be sarcastic? How about you listen to my deductions for a change of pace? She's really snappy right now. You may think it absurd, but don't you think the case you are pursuing and the actions of the Phantom Thieves overlap somehow? What are you basing this off of? The one point of commonality across all cases is how those involved have an unforeseen change of heart. I've suspected that myself, but those suspicions are unfounded. I told you at the beginning that this was only a deduction. These just phantom thieves are riling up the public. However, that is a disguise. Huh? Their true goal is terrorist action by way of psychotic breakdowns. Is that too much? Huh? I'm sorry. What? 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 Akachi. Akachi, why? There's nothing at the moment that falsifies that claim. Have you mentioned this to the police? No! I'd never tell them such things. Okay, whew. The only value they have to me is in their mobility and organizational capabilities. Hmm. It seems having you lend me a hand has paid off. Um. I'm glad to hear that. Hmm? What about your case, Sai-san? I differ. Did you learn anything from the guardian of that mental shutdown victim's daughter? Oh, my voice is okay. Thank you for checking in. Nothing at all. Huh? I see. Ah, oh, crap, Dipper. What's what I just miss? Dipper just entered at a bad time. Shoot. And I press the button, go, the A button, recklessly. Now, what should my next action be for our victory? Uh, I feel like I just missed something important. No! Handle the Phantom Thieves without remorse. No! Use any means necessary to win. That's how I would deal with them. Check the log. <gasps> Ooh. Uh, I forget, how do I check the log? Go. Wait, hold on. How, what what did I miss? Hold on. Uh, the only value they have to me is their mobility and organizational capabilities. Da, 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 da. I'm glad to see that. What about your case? Did you learn anything from the guardian of that mental shutdown victim's daughter? The guardian? She's not even staying with a mom? Uh, 
Mental shutdown victim's daughter. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Very well. This seems to be fun for you. Are you on to something? No, not at all. Well then, to our victory. Okay. Time for sushi. This place is in Ginza, right? Do we take the usual train from Shibuya? Oh, hell yeah, Ginza, baby! Famous for luxury shopping. It's Yes, it is. Its property values are the highest in all of Japan, the forefront of trends. Aside from the shops, cafes are plenty. If you're tired from shopping, get tea. Yeah. Ginza's nice to look at, but damn. <laughs> if you're on the poor side of things, just, 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 just window shop. getting sushi tomorrow uh, I don't see any prices listed here oh no Yusuke that is terrifying when you don't see prices and you order something no it's called market price don't worry about it we got the cash I hate this so good <laughs> if we blew all our money on this sushi I'm gonna be mad Tuna ready yet? Get your horses. And don't talk. Oh no. By the way, is boss really the kind of person who would abuse someone? I said no, and I will put my foot down on that again. No. That again? I can't get it off my mind. Especially if it means he could be taken to court. <coughs> Ugh, sorry. What kind of person is he? Do you truly believe he'd do such a thing? He wouldn't! He is pretty strict. Not a chance. I don't know. No chance. Hmm. If it's really true about the abuse, he'd be a no good jerk pretending to be a guardian. He didn't do it! I believe in him! Maybe the chief is the one who needs a change of heart. Stop! Hold on a sec. About that, I actually got curious after our conversation and checked his name in the nav. What? Sounds to me like there wasn't a hit. Right. Anything beyond this is his family's problem. We probably shouldn't get any more involved. Guardian problem. I bet that guy was set up. Falsely accused, like me. Wait, you think Alibaba could be Boss's ex-wife? Ah. Huh? He must have cheated on her, and that's where Futaba came from. Oh. Doubtful. Your imagination has run rampant. How foolish. Yeesh. Mm. Still, this is delicious. I've never experienced anything quite like it before. Man, and it's all thanks to us being the fan of these. Freaking Ryuji! Even the sushi man turned around. I can't with this man. He's- I swear, he needs a muzzle. Uh, um, f f fan fantastic This sushi is delicious! Y yeah The fish is so fresh! Hm. I 
everywhere we go, we hear about these phantom thieves. What rubbish. Think about where we are, Ryuji. Use that one brain cell you have. Please, Ryuji. Sorry, it just kind of slipped. I need to duct tape your mouth, I swear. My apologies for bringing up boss again. We should just enjoy the food. Yes, why are we having such a serious discussion when we're supposed to be celebrating with our newfound money? Y'all, I'm disappointed in the in this crew right now. Ijima san, what are you doing here? Ah, Akechido! Akechi kun. Akechi? You're the ones from the TV station. Could it be that you're friends of Nijima san? Do you know this guy? It's nice to meet you. My name is Akechi. Glad to make your acquaintance, Yusuke Kitagawa. How do you know my name? Uh huh. Well, because I'm a psychic, of course. Not cute. <laughs> I'm only joking. In truth, I'm a rookie detective. You're a former pupil of Madarame, right? Ooh. I have actually just recently joined the investigation team looking into the Phantom Thieves. No! Did you see that Mejed has declared war on them? War? Their website was updated just a moment ago. For real? Ah, English again! I... Can someone take Ryuji away when Ekichi's around, please? Please, someone take Ryuji away. Pull him away somewhere. He's gonna slip up again, and Ekichi's gonna have the, the answer. It's gonna... Ugh. If it's not Mishima, it's gonna be Ryuji that rats us out. <laughs> Wait, what? What's it say? Huh. Why do you seem so agitated? No reason. She's uh, a, a huge fan of the Phantom Thieves. Uh, a total nut job for him. Uh huh. Hmm. I don't know how wise it is to be a fan of groups like them. What is with these comments? My apologies. I didn't mean to butt into your conversation, but I must say, this is an interesting group. Please go away. Prosecutor Nijima's sister, an ex pupil of Madarame. And a few Shujin Academy students. Uh shit. Okay, this is actually kind of sus that we're all in the same group. Oh no. It seems you're all connected to the Phantom Thieves. Perhaps you have better intel than I do. Oh no, I didn't think about this. Oh no. Ekichi did a real big brain right there. Oh no. Yes, I wanted to ask you something. Regarding this whole Mejed commotion, if you were one of the Phantom Thieves, what would you do? Y'all, we need to scatter. We need to scatter. Being together as a group is very dangerous. Oh god, regarding the whole Mejed commotion, if you were one of the Met Phantom Thieves, what would you do? Ah, oh, retaliate, ignore them, I don't care. <laughs> I mean, as long as they're not getting in my business, I don't know. Oh god. Just kill it and hide the body. <laughs> Time to order it. <laughs> Ekichi is really sharp. It's scary. I mean... Ignore them? That is unexpected. Only a small minority of people believe that is the best decision. Sorry to disappoint, but we're just normal high school kids. If anything, we want to hear what you gotta say, Mr. Detective. My profiling of the Phantom Thieves has led me to believe they are a group of juveniles. Mm, no. They have a relative amount of free time after school and a hideout to slip away to. Ah, oh, shit. Furthermore, considering Kamashita was their first target, it seems they began activity around April. 
In a way, all I've just said about the Phantom Thieves coincides with the group you have here. No! <laughs> this is bad! This is bad! What? You gonna report us? I didn't say I was being suspicious of you. You're definitely implying it, though. You're the suspicious one. Ryuji's a phantom thief. Response, you will always find a way to rise above my expectations. <laughs> you really are an intriguing one. <laughs> I can't believe that was an option. That's so funny. I lack your calm mannerisms, but don't you think my deduction is an interesting one? It's too much, my dude. Akuchi, I'm scared. You're dangerous. I bet we'd make a great team if we worked together. Well, this has been a valuable point of reference for me. I hope to see you all again. <laughs> Discard the wink link. God, that's amazing. You think he's ascertained our true identities? I don't know, but I just realized it's Sunday and I need to get a smoothie. Nah, couldn't be. Right? No, he totally figured this out. We're in, we're we're shit out of out of luck, you guys. We're SOL. We're SOL real big time. I'd like to say that it's simply us overthinking this, but it may be best to be cautious from now on. We shouldn't forget that Alibaba was able to discover who we are. Cautious, cautious. Tell that to Ryuji. <laughs> True, but it's not as though he had tangible evidence to prove that discovery. Still, we are a really sus group together. Just keep acting normally. We're literally the gathered evidence of the of, of the after the Phantom Thieves have 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 done their Phantom Thieving shit. With the enemy bosses. Like, this is- this is super telling. This is not good. More importantly, things are getting serious with Medjet. What did they say? Oh yeah, what did they write? Here, I'll read it. We are disappointed in the people of Japan and their belief in the Phantom Thieves' false justice. Hence, we shall proceed with our plan to cleanse Japan. This process will commence on August 21st. Huh? As a result, the Japanese economy shall suffer devastating damages. Oh my god! Wait, hold on a minute! For real? Keep going. However, we are magnanimous. We will give the Phantom Thieves one final opportunity to repent. As proof of this repentance, we demand that they reveal their identities to the public. Uh oh. We will attack if these demands remain unmet. The future of Japan rests with the Phantom Thieves. This is getting a little too out of hand and aggressive. What the hell? We are Majed. We are unseen. We will eliminate evil. That's what it says. This is real serious. Mm, sounds bad. In other words, For real? if we don't unmask <laughs> ourselves, Majed will attack Japan, correct? It seems they are quite the attention seekers. What are we gonna do about this? We give them Ryuji. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. If only we could get in contact with Alibaba. Our only clues are Boss and Futaba. 
Anyways, it's too damn hot out here. Why don't we go to LeBlanc? We can talk more over there. Okay. We went through all sorts of options on our way here, but... Looks like we got no choice but to ask for Alibaba's help. Hmm. Question is, how do we get in touch with him? He cut off all contact with us after that misunderstanding. Then again, if we manage to steal Futaba's heart, he may attempt to reach out to us once more. But we don't have any clues on what her keywords are. Damn it, Alibaba! Where the hell are you? Actually, he may be closer than we think. Huh? Hypothetically speaking, even if we stole Futaba's heart, how would Alibaba know that the deed has been done? Would he truly be able to discern that just from cell phone messages? You mean he'd have to meet her in person? Alibaba was able to deliver the calling card here. On top of that, he can check on Futaba's condition. However, according to the circumstances he put forth, he's unable to meet with us. This leads me to believe that it would be bad for him if we were to see the two of them together. It seems to me, Alibaba may in fact be Futaba herself. Yeah, okay. For real? So she's asking that we steal her own heart? Yeah, that's what's weird. Maybe she wants us to save her from the scars of her abuse. That would be hard to ask directly. Ooh. I'd like to meet with Boss. He lives nearby, right? Uh... I know where his house is? I do? Anna. I agree. It's real late, though. What are we gonna tell boss when we get there? We'll say this takeout sushi is a gift for him. Clever girl. But my fatty tuna! No complaining. Let's all go together. Boss may get the wrong idea if he and I show up alone. What? Nobody's answering. But the lights are on. Think she's napping? Even Boss would have woken up with how many times we've rung this doorbell. I would think Futaba would have answered by now if she were here, too. Weird. Oh, the gate is unlocked. Oh, okay. Casually open the gate. Sure, okay. Dude, you can't go opening other people's stuff like that. But look, the door seems to be slightly open as well. This is, oh, guys, this is bad. Don't, you're breaking and entering. I wonder why. That's rather careless. Whoa. It sounds like it's going to rain. We should get inside. We're inviting ourselves into someone's home without their permission. This is real bad. Do you think that's okay? No, it's not. Probably. No, it's not. My apologies, boss. This is not okay! Hey, we're gonna get shot. Hello, sir? He's not out, is he? The door ahead is open, and I can hear the TV. Hope he didn't pass out or something. I mean, boss is kinda old, ain't he? I'm a bit worried. Should we go in and check on him? Please excuse us. Oh my god, it's a horror movie now. Ah! Ah! Scream? What was that? How should I know? Oh god, it got spoopy. Did you hear that? Let's get out of here, please! Can we just go? What are you freaking out for? You're totally freaking out, but I don't blame you. Could it be Alibaba? I mean, Futaba? That's 
sorry. Um, can I hold your hand? Wait, what? Yes! Yes! Hold my hand! Totally! I got. I gotta look cool too. Who is it? Who's there? I can't take this anymore. I'm leaving. Oh, did you just lose feeling to your legs? No. My legs won't move. Oh, that's such a classic. Can I princess carry you? Don't shoot me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, sis. Somebody please save me. Save you? Save me! What are you doing in my house? <laughs> please don't shoot me. Uh... You are. Oh, uh, good, good evening, sir. Uh, we. We didn't mean to intrude. Oh, we totally meant to intrude. Nijima-san. Wait, are, are you two dating? Oh, hell yeah. Yeah. Come on, Makoto. Let me just have this one. Let me have this cool moment. We're just friends. Damn. Friends nowadays get that close to each other? <laughs> but that's not it. This, um, uh, things happened and. Go on. You kids are here too? <laughs> uh, we brought you some sushi, but nobody answered when we ring the bell. The door was unlocked too. We could hear the TV though, so we got worried he might have passed out or something. The door was unlocked? Yes. <sighs> I do that sometimes. Guess I'm getting old. Um, excuse me. There's something we'd like to ask. Hmm? You want to ask me? There's someone else living here. Isn't there? Mm, yeah. My daughter. Could she be Utaba Sakura? It was nice knowing you, Makoto. I am not doing anything to make Dad upset anymore. You told Nijima-san too? Damn it! Uh, um, is there any way we could meet with Utaba san I don't win. I just don't win. I think we may have frightened her earlier, so... We'd like to apologize, if at all possible. Clever. Well, uh, that's... Is she sick? Is she shy? No, no, it's not like that. I don't want you all getting the wrong idea. What is it? I shouldn't have kept this a secret from you. I mean, it's your life and family, dude. I, it's, <laughs> I'm just some guy who wants to be your son living at your your coffee shop. <laughs> Let's talk at my shop. She'll hear us if we stay here. Yeah, okay. Now, where do I start? That I'm your favorite boy? I mean, what? 
Futaba's mother and I knew each other long before Futaba was born. Uh huh. Her mother was a bit of a weird one, but we got along well for some reason. Yo, hit that like button if you're one of the guys who like the weird ones. <laughs> Let's go. She was sharp-witted, somewhat stern, a little socially inept, but always carefree. She truly was a great woman. I see. When something piqued her interest, that'd be all she focused on. She always worked deep into the night. I thought that'd change after her kid was born. But having Futaba didn't do much. Even with that, she always took good care of her. Working and watching over a child at the same time sounds rough. Yes! I guess raising Futaba alone turned out to be tough on her in more ways than one. Alone? There wasn't a father. Do you mean... Well, there probably was one. I didn't know him, though. She never said a word about him, either. Oh. She was single when she gave birth to Futaba, and single when she raised her. They were an ordinary, loving family. You could really tell how much she cared for Futaba. <sighs> but one day, she left, leaving Futaba behind. Oh, no. Yes, she committed suicide. <gasps> suicide? Dark. Threw herself into the street, right in front of Futaba's eyes. Oh. Shocking doesn't begin to describe that. Oh my god. It's gotta be devastating for a kid. So, well, a lot happened after that, but I ended up taking custody of Futaba. First, she was so depressed, she, she wouldn't even talk to me. Was that because she couldn't get over her mother's suicide? I kept talking to her, though, and she started opening up to me, little by little. Sojiro, you're a good man. That's when I found out. Utaba blames herself for her mother's death. What? But why? That part she's never told me. I wanted to know what led her to believing that. But I decided not to rub salt in her wound. Oh no, it's gonna be one of those. If I wasn't born, my mother wouldn't have, have I don't know, get stressed out or something situation. Oh no, oh no. Then, a few months ago, she started getting real scared, even when nothing was happening. A few months ago? She'd say things like, I hear voices and mom is looking at me. What? Visual and auditory hallucinations. She's going mad? Have you taken Futaba to a doctor? I wanted to, but she refused. Even when I had a doctor come, she locked herself away in her room. Since then, she's become what you'd call a shut-in. A neat. She won't take a single step outside the house. Or even try to see other people. Oh no. She shut herself away. She shut her heart. You? She doesn't even let me come in her room. That's pretty harsh. Futaba is, well, a unique girl. She's so quick-minded that conversations with her tend to jump from one topic to the next. Oh. It seems like she's always coming to conclusions in her head. There's a lot I don't get about her. Mm. So, yeah, her situation is why I couldn't let you in my house. 
Don't worry about it, I understand. What Futaba needs is a safe place where nobody will threaten her. Somewhere she can be at ease. That's why I won't do anything she doesn't want. I don't make her do anything she's unwilling to either. Oh boy. And again, I know that's no way for her to live. Oh, no it's not. It's all I can do though. What does Futaba want? I don't know. She just asks me for things that she wants, like food or these complicated books. Well, that's that. So I'm guessing she doesn't even go to school either. So, can you just leave her be? Mm, nope. <laughs> Sorry, Dad. <laughs> I'm gonna head back then. You all had better head home soon, too. I feel awful for prying into his personal affairs. No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her mother. So she'd like to discard her feelings of pain, but can't do anything about it herself. Damn. Will changing her heart really help her, though? Does it work that way? If we can help her, we may be able to stand up to Medjet. <sighs> we do need clues. Hold on a sec. Do we even know if she has a palace? Wait, have you said her name on the nav yet? Let's check. The Futaba Sakura that lives at Sojiro Sakura's house. Is that gonna be enough? Candidate found. Oh, shit! What the? She's got one. Oh, damn, her heart's really warped. So someone can have a palace even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana. Morgana? Where's Morgana? I haven't seen him for some time. Did we leave him back at the house? So, ever since we went inside Boss's house? Oh, no. Somewhere around there. He'll be fine, though. He's a cat, after all. Uh... The trains are gonna be shutting down for the night soon, so we should probably be heading home. We have to go to school in the morning, after all. Oh, right. The urgent assembly. Gross. An assembly? What about? Shujin has been garnering a lot of attention ever since Medjed called out the Phantom Thieves. So, they need to remind us not to say arbitrary stuff online and add more fuel to the fire. We gotta meet up for every goddamn little thing. <sighs> Talk about a pain in the ass. I mean, it is our fault. Meh. Anyway, let's contact each other afterward. No way in hell he's abusing her. The reason why Futaba wants her heart stolen must be related to what happened to her mother. Uh-oh. So she'd like to discard her feelings of pain, but can't do anything about it herself. Will changing her heart really help her, though? If we can help her, we may be able to stand up to Medjet. Hold on a sec. Do we even know if she has a palace? Let's check. The Futaba Sakura that lives at Sojiro Sakura's house. Is that gonna be enough? What the...? She's got one! So someone can have a palace even if they're not evil? Hey, Morgana! Morgana! I have no cat to stop me. <laughs> I am free! <laughs> I can do whatever I want. Like nice. Oh my god, 80 hours in the game. Morgana and I might pass each other. I should wait until tomorrow. I am my own worst enemy. No! <laughs> oh, 
Oh, well. Alright, listen, y'all. It's 2 a.m. for me. We've been going on for almost, uh, almost six hours. Five hours and 40 minutes, to be exact-ish. I think this is a good stopping point to continue the story tomorrow. Um, to me, it's just later today. <laughs> But thank you all for joining in tonight's, um, tonight's, uh, stream. This was a lot to unpack. Such a good, uh, I want to call them episode. Such a good episode. Such a good stream night. We got to learn more about Dad and his daughter. I'm clearly not, not, not remembering things. <laughs> and connecting the dots. But, you know, it's fine. It just makes for better surprises later, so I'm excited about that, and I really don't want to think too much and spoil things ahead of time. So yeah, let's... I'm gonna keep shutting my brain off as I play this game. <laughs> so I can... I can enjoy the moment. Um... God, a lot of heavy things were happening tonight. Futaba and now... and also Kawa. Kawa also dropped some heavy uh, backstory stuff too. Well, not backstory, but like we're now in the in the living in the moment of the issue with those like butthole parents or whatever they are guardians like they're the worst um but the futaba situation yeah that's i was joking about it i shouldn't say i was joking about it no i was thinking about it but it's such an interesting event that it's happening now the whole like you can because I've seen the intro, I've already seen the character. It clearly shows who's going to be part of the Persona gang. Um, wait, does that mean that she's going to be joining? Because I think I saw his face in there too. Ooh. Um. Anyways, I'm just prattling at this point. Um, but yeah, the whole like, if you ha it doesn't matter if you're good or bad. I guess it's just as long as your heart isn't just emotionally wrecked out the wazoo, you get a palace. Um, so I am both terrified and fascinated to see what's gonna happen, cause it, we're gonna be discovering some dark events about her mom or something. Uh, it, oof, I wonder if this is gonna bring tears to my eyes. I'm really curious about that. I'm so curious. 3 a.m. here, oh boy. I'm making you guys into night owls, sorry. <laughs> Joker is too nice to think that he thinks about Morgana. Yeah, Joker's sweet. No, Joker's a good man. He's a good guy. Good guy. Here's your chance to be Sojiro's son for real. I am committing! I am committing to Kawa! <laughs> um, but yeah, I- this was a really good run tonight. I think we got a good chunk- a good chunk of MSQ storytelling going on tonight. Let's do it. Let me go ahead and save again, just first, just to make sure. And then I'll just add this. No, 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 no. I don't want to add that. And then, uh, yeah, call it a night. I wonder how. Uh, oh, gosh, I'm wondering if you guys want to hang out Sunday night for Easter. But again, that's gonna be a lot of streams happening. I need to get. I also need to get ready and set up Final Fantasy VII Stream Two, so I can at least play it twice this week. Um, no, how about Wednesday? All right, I'm just thinking out loud. <laughs> all right, there we go. Boop. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, a lot of stuff happened. A lot of stuff happened tonight. Um, all right. So yeah, if you're new to the channel, welcome, hello. I hope you had a good night tonight. It was a lot of fun. Um, I enjoy playing story-based games and I can't wait to play more. Um, the the uh, the Dickerson arc will be coming in for Persona 3 or 4, what it depends on what you guys vote for. Yeah, this is this is on you to choose. Uh, but we're, we will worry about that in later, uh, I guess when we get closer to finishing up Persona 5. Um, we're halfway through from what you guys told me, so I'm super excited. I'm super excited. Grab tissues just in case then. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. Is it going to make me cry as much as it did the chopper arc? 
I can never let that one go. I'm not done with One Piece, but the Chopper, the Chopper backstory, man. That, <laughs> that's just too much crying. <laughs> too much crying on that one. I can't let that one go. I haven't cried that hard in a really long time for over an anime. Um, but yeah, been lurking. Lurking's fine. Yeah, no, your lurking, your lurking helps. Ooh, actually, okay, go be weird for me to ask. Kind of like a weird request thing. <laughs> I I might mix in um. Uh, for those of you who who want to finish up and uh the the weird uh the weird psychotic um. Uh, the, the weird psychotic chaos video uh what's it called um the andy and lele thing uh i still need to finish that um i think that i'll i i think i'm going to be mixing that in with a with a sponsor thing i think if it goes through please don't mind it <laughs> please don't mind it <laughs> i just i just want to give a warning about that <laughs> Um, but yeah, I think as soon as I get the okay, we'll get the, we'll, we'll be able to finish up the Andy and Lele. Um, I think that's it. I, I think that's it. Okay. All right, then. I want to wish you all a good night. And again, don't forget, uh, stream will be later for part two of Persona. We do it Fridays and Saturday nights. And uh, if, again, if you're new to the channel, don't forget to hit that sub button so that way you can save my channel and those likes will help the algorithm god tell them to be like, hey, this channel needs to be known more. So yeah, uh, congratulations everyone. We did it, we got 30K. Let's hit for 40. Let's go, let's go. The chaos, the chaos crew will keep growing. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> All right, then. Have a wonderful, beautiful night, everybody, okay? Uh, stay safe. Rest well. And I'll see you next stream, okay? Bye-bye. <laughs>